so yeah, I, I, I talked about this. Uh, when I play Dwarf Fortress, I want to play RimWorld. When I play RimWorld, I want to play Dwarf Fortress. So today, we're playing RimWorld Dwarf Fortress. Uh, I've added in some mods. We've got the medieval overhaul. We've got the fancy of the rim as well as a couple other things. Um, which gives us things like elves and dwarves and orcs and all that and medieval -y things. Uh, and we're going to go out. I've actually, I've made myself a, uh, a start as well called the RimWorld Fortress. Praise Armok. I have this uploaded on the Steam Workshop. Uh, those of you live right now, I don't have the links for these things. But when this goes to YouTube, I'll have links for the collection and the scenario. If you want to follow along uh, in this crazy dwarf fortress room world thing. So we got a match. We got we got a faction of a mercenary company. Seven people. Of course, we got stone cutting, smithing, and brewing. Our uh, mining speed is very fast. We mine like uh, well, like dwarves. We begin with a few things: some cats, of course, some mushroom soup. We got a random pet. We got some steel war hammers and axes. Uh, we're going to be at a map with a wooden cart, some wood, and a ruined castle. I'll show what all the other mods give us. But, um, yeah, let's jump in here. Uh, I think we're going to go for the the true Dwarf Fortress experience, which is clearly random, Randy Random. And I think we want Blood and Dust. Face brutal survival challenges. Even if you play well, people will die. You will need to anticipate threats before they arrive and seek out every advantage. That's Dwarf Fortress if I ever heard of it. Losing is fun is really Dwarf Fortress. Um, okay. Losing is fun. It only makes sense that lo wait, we sh I didn't even realize this was what <laughs> we really should be playing Losing is Fun as a Dwarf Fortress style of game. Uh, yes, I. those of you who have been following along for a while, I have done this a few times in the past. In fact, I think with every update, I come in and I do a Dwarf Fortress room world thing. But now we have kids, and we have like a dwarf race, which is what inspired this thing. I'm going to God Dwarves, but I, I, we're going to play it again. Uh, a dad joke. Um, so, um, something I was doing um, this past summer, a uh, little info about me. Is I went and I took this uh, this 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 culinary class, this baking class, at the, uh, the local community center. But uh, it wasn't really much of a challenge. Uh, uh, every every test was a piece of cake. <clears throat> all right, all right. So enough of that. Losing is fun. We're going in with this, uh, Randy Random. We may die, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, we'll reload any time. Just just you know for funds. Uh, our uh, our seed's going to be Untinti. And all of our factions we have in the game, we've got the elves, we have night elves, we have dwarves, we have quirks. Uh, there's a lot of different factions in here. I think I may remove actually a couple of these. Um, we've got cave snakes and insect gene lines and mechanoid hives. I'm going to get rid of mechanoids. I'm going to get rid of the empire and I think everything else is okay. We'll leave everything else in there. So, um, yeah, that seems like a good, yeah, let's generate this map. See what kind of world we can get. Dad jokes are my bread and butter. Mm. It's got a, I got a good recipe for dad jokes. <laughs> All right. Um, one of these things in the mod here, it gives us. Uh, that's not the one. Where? Oh, we don't have any. Oh, there it is. There we have a tiny little patch of dark forest, right over there. A couple little patches of dark forest on this world. Uh, which, which the Panther Toe Range, uh, which is a new map, which comes along with one of these mods, the um, the medieval mod, and uh, I think we might as well use it. I um, I kind of have a hankering to start near some elves. We can maybe cause a ruckus with the elves. The union of of Banamni are the elves. We got night elves as the purple one there. Um, what was the yellow? Oh, we don't know. Um, the dwarves are like the mountain one. Okay, so that green one was uh, was elves, right? Night elves. Uh, no, no, that was the that's the Neanderthals. Night elves are purple. Okay, we got we can we could start like over those orcs right there. We can start next to the orcs. Orcs there. There's elves down this way, and over here. Hey, Harley, how's it going? Uh, who's the blue? Blue is the pig union. Uh, there's dwarves over that way. I think I think I kind of like the idea of starting over this way somewhere. I think it's really cold in the wintertime, but we in the mountains will be all right. Um, yeah, like tucked in here in the in the dark forest. 
Right there, I think. We can crawl our way out. It might be a little too close to them. Is that too close to them? Small map. I think it's... Uh, no, no, it's fine. It's four away, so it's it's fine. Okay, so yeah, we'll start right there. And we've got a few folks around. Uh, we can. It's a long trek to get to the elves. But we may, we may try to do it at some point. I'm really hoping to go kill some elves. Oh, hey, wait, we got Dark Forest right here. It's not as mountainous as I was hoping for. But we could be there. We're in range of the of the orcs. We're in range of uh who's the red? Of the imp the impids. Uh, we've got elves down this way elves and uh and whatever the other one was, the green folks down down there, the uh the Neanderthals. Yeah, yeah. Like this little patch right here, this tiny little forest right in here. And right on the edge of it. This is large hills, this is mountains. We want the real mountains. Something like that right there. Yeah, that little spot right there. I, this is kind of nice though, like tucked into the mountains there. That's dwarfy, isn't it? I'm sorry, I don't have my, my bot isn't working. I don't have my mods going. I apologize. Yeah, not too bad. Harley, thanks for asking. We're close to, who's that? Uh, I just looked at that one. That's the orcs, right? Yeah, orcs. So yeah, yeah, let's do that. We're gonna spot right over there. Uh, on a, uh, a small map, I like the small maps, right, in tucked on in there. Uh, I will do the ideology. Uh, I'm going to go with the fluid ideology, and we'll just let it kind of do its thing. Uh, we'll go with the... The gods walk the planets like us, yet they are powerful and immortal as we are not. So they decide the moral structure of the universe. That seems like a good thing. I like that. And our starting meme is going to be, I think, just loyalist. We stand for our own before others. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. I like that. Stello faith, no good. The temple, hmm? That's pretty good. Give me, give me a good one. Loyal path, uh, loyaltism. That's terrible. The Kimian temple, even better. Kimian temple. Kimian temple. I like it. We got Faulus, the master of creation. Uh, um, we got Untinti, Master of Creation, and the Min Mino, Master of Life over there. Um, I think everything else here is fine. No cannibalism. We don't eat our own. That's not, none of that nonsense. Um, everything else is okay. Yeah. Fieldist, Priest. We got some relics and some shields, looks like. We love wargs. And uh, beards are a thing. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's do it. Now, uh, I need to check. Some, I, I tried messing with that that starting thing. I couldn't figure out how to change it to where everyone was the same race. I was going to come in here and originally make this thing out so everyone was the dirt moles. That was the original thought of why I was going to do this. But uh, I got that mod, and it adds in dwarves. And dwarves seem pretty good because dwarves are cold tolerant. They're strong melee damage. They're robust. They're a little ugly. An elf must have made this. Uh, bushy beards, of course, alcohol dependency, good miners. I mean, that kind of fits us pretty well. So I'm going to go with just everyone on, on dwarves. We got Grump is his name. Uh, so yeah, we're going to switch everyone over to a, to a dwarf. Um, to uh, I really want to want to have a, a kid. And I don't know if I want to go ahead and just make a kid now. Or if I want to just hope we have a kid. Uh, I'm not I'm not sure. Alcohol dependency is is on everyone, of course, because we're dwarves. This guy's got dementia and hearing loss. Can I like switch this guy out a little bit? Um, dementia is great, but uh, you know, let's get Ballas in there or, or Bales. Bales. So I guess Fox has a son named Rico. He hates them. Uh, uh, Neville hates his sister. Uh, Anf Anfia hates hates her brother. Gert doesn't care about anybody. <clears throat> uh, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll go over the mods in a minute, and I'm not putting Elf Lover in my, in, in my list, Master Lith. A lot of slow pokes. We're very slow, apparently, as dwarves. We're very good miners, though. We got a good shooter there. We got everything covered. We don't have much of a cook, which might be a little bit of a problem. We got a good planter. Um, I'm gonna get... Everyone's pretty... I kinda like everyone, other than the lack of cooking. Anyone have a passion for cooking? Not really. Well, let me switch out Gert here. Healer Gert. Who's not 
really a healer. Well, he's not the best healer, so I'm going to switch him out. I want a good cook. Give me a good cook. Or at least someone that has, like, a little liking to cooking. Anyone like to cook? There we go. We got Pablo McLean. What a <laughs> what a dwarfy name. He's very frail. He doesn't like his brother. He's got some wine with him. Um, and he knows how to cook. That's all we care about. He's also a stew keeper. Okay. Let's, uh, oh, wait, wait, we'll get some names in here. Uh, Pablo McLean, I, I can't change. I can't change Pablo McLean. That's just too good of a dwarf name. I just can't do it. Ah, an italics raid. Hey, italics, how's it going? Well, what timing? We we are just beginning. I'll go over the mods in a minute. But we are playing Dwarf Fortress Roomworld style. How was... Uh, I saw you were playing Roomworld as well. How did it go? <laughs> Thanks, Harley. So, uh, Pablo McLean is too good of a dwarf name. We're going to leave Pablo McLean as it is. So. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Italics. <laughs> uh, we got Marmello. Uh, who is our miner? I think they're all gonna be miners here. Uh, we got Burns. You may notice they all have gear because we've got we're like a mercenary company, right? We're charging in there. We've got axes and and whatever else. Let's see how it goes. Let's just get in here. I hope we find. Oh, that's right. I didn't put Urist in there. You're right. Bluest. Uh, the first baby will be named Urist, and then Harley. You can have the next one. Cepheid, thanks for following. You have arrived. After a journey from the mountain homes into the forbidding wilderness beyond, your harsh trek has finally ended. Your party of seven is to make an outpost for all the glory, or the glory of all, of Rimworld Fortress. No supplies left, but with stout labor comes sustenance. Whether by bolt, plow, or hook, provide for your dwarves. Expecting a supply caravan just before winter entombs you, but it's spring now. Enough time to delve secure lodging ere the muffaloes get hungry. A new chapter of dwarven history begins at this place. Umtinti's Whisker. Strike the earth. All right, all right. Oh, we have a good mountain here. Okay, good, good, good. So we're we're, we're stumbling on in here from the north. We got a little bit of food. Um, I'll go. I'll go unlock that stuff. Let me uh, let me get everyone kind of like in their path, getting things moved around, and then I'll show the mods off here. But um, so the setting is we're like a, we're like a, a company of dwarves, seven of us are strolling on in, and uh, we're gonna go build ourselves a a well. A dwarven fortress, obviously. <clears throat> Only mostly did, huh? Yeah, they do. I do. <laughs> I did. I, I did put an axe on there. Look, there's our cart. I did put an axe on there because uh, I was a little nervous. I, I, just out of what happened last time. Make sure we have an axe. It's very important. Don't forget your axe. Let's do like a, a little. We'll tuck in right there for now. Just a, uh, a a decent start right there. We'll get that, get that over there, and I want to get a stockpile set up. We're just going to pop it in right here. Now, I think we may cover this thing because we don't like being outside because it's bright outside, and we hate that. I think. Actually, I'm going to look, 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 look at doors real quick. Um, oh, they don't. Okay, so I was playing I've, I've playing this before, as I said, with the other the Rimworld dwarves, the dirt moles, and they don't like the light. People were dying. or getting People getting real mad. All right, so I'm gonna allow this stuff here. Okay, so we're gonna carry all of this junk we've got down down that way. Tammy the cat, and um, we've got Nathan the, uh, the the warg, and Brandywine the cat. I've had Brandywine like so many times in this game. Brandywine. Anyway, the mods. Um, how do I look at the mods? I forget. Uh, mod. Uh, so they, oh, they're there. I think it's all of them. So the medieval overhaul is the main one. Um, which does all the medieval stuff to make it look, well, medieval. Uh, and then I've got, um, I don't think the other one's showing up in here. The other one is, is fantasy races, which, um, adds in the dwarves and elves and orcs and night elves. And we begin next, like next to a castle here. So we got some beds tucked in here. We got some cool, uh, uh, doors. Let me show you the stuff that we can do here. This is all from the medieval overhaul mod. We got butcher's blocks and fermenting barrels. Uh, left in the game anyway. Uh, stone cutting spots and um, anvils and furnaces. <clears throat> um, we got cool brick stacks, meat hooks, food baskets. 
And the car frame. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's Dwarf Fortress. There's always weird things. <laughs> hey, Gavin, how's it going? All right, so we're going to dig on in here and we'll get us get a start going. Let's go ahead and get like food going. This is the Dark Force uh, map, which is also part of the, the Medieval Overhaul mod. It's very dark and spooky. Um, well, sort of. But we're going to go ahead and, and chop some of these trees. Goblin friends. You know what, Masterlith? I don't know about this. Uh, which I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um... Yeah, let's actually let's go ahead and get let's clear up this place like right here. Clean this spot out here. We'll do a little bit of like berry picking and uh, get get the basics down. You know, these uh, actually they put stuff on these shelves, didn't they? It's like shelves already built in here. Hey, Pablo, can you um come on in here? Come here. Let's go check out this place. Yeah, like when Ash went through the time tunnel and sucked his car through. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Attack Frog, the hero of no one. Thanks for following. Dan and uh, Zethican, thanks for following. I certainly appreciate it. There's a uh, granite wood-burning stove there. We got some shelves in there. I'm going to have to go check out the VOD of Vitalix, apparently, because apparently it's something exciting is happening. <clears throat> Uh, also, uh, I think you guys came in after I had set up the, the difficulty stuff. We're on Losing is Fun, Randy Random, so it may be kind of exciting today. An Evil Dead mod would be great. There's a bunch of, bunch of deadites around. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get a... Ooh, we have a gate. Reinforced gate divides rooms. Simple gates must be manually opened. Look at that. Uh, I just want a rustic door. Double rustic door right there. We got castle walls we can put in and embrasures, em embrasures and palisades. We'll just put in a, a, a starting spot here. We'll get these beds moved in and just get some things hauled over this way. Um, I think our food is probably going to be mushrooms. I think um, we can really grow anything in here, I suppose. Probably should go ahead and get some stuff started early, though, because we don't want to... We don't want to starve to death. I have a problem with that in this game. Let's lay out a patch there. I'll just do some potatoes just to get something done. And let's make sure everyone's doing the jobs we want them to do. So, I don't have that mod on me. Uh, let's go get everyone firefighting. And uh, patient if... Yeah, yeah, all that stuff. we got two good doctors, actually, in this place. we got Ulurin, Ulurin and, uh, and Burns. Both want a doctor. Um, everyone loves to mine. Look how fast they mine. Um, I'm sure everyone's doing something. We got a good cook with Pablo. We've got childcare with Zahn, but we don't really need to worry about that. Is it 2003 when Dwarf Fortress started? I was wondering. I, think, I was thinking 2005 for some reason, but man, that's a long time. I cannot wait for December 6th. Uh, we did the um, uh, loyal, loyal, I think is what, right? Loyal, that's the name of it. Uh, start. There's a gate right there. Get all this stuff moved in in a second. Um, let's go and... So we've got like our... We'll have like a little starting area and we'll set up... It's like, like a fortress, you know? Let's do a, a path here and we'll build out from there. I suppose. Uh, yeah, fluid. Yeah. And we'll do... Something like that. It's mostly wanted to get like... A, get a stockpile room set up here. And... Let's we'll do this. That's not all, not centered. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get some of these these furniture or production things done already. Stone cutter table. We also have a stone cutter spot, um, which probably is a good idea to get started in here pretty early. So we'll set that in. We've got a cooking table we can get over here as well, and a cleaning bench. I haven't figured out table to clean loot and ready for them to display. Uh, we also have workbench, which of course we'll need. And so this is just sort of starter crafty, crafty land right in here, just to get everything started up. We got a researching spot for the beginning be right there. We're gonna have to make sure we get these these barrels fermenting because we need to get our booze going. Uh, I begin with enough steel ingots on this start to be able to make the the where is it 
um, the cooking table. No, not the cooking table. Something. Some. Uh, uh, I think it's the brewery. I think it's what, it, what needs it. Something needs it. Um, and so we can get the, the, the brewing process uh, going. I'm not actually sure what needs it. Smithy needs steel ingots. Um, Stone cutter's table needs those sting, sting, steel ingots. The brewery. Yeah, there it is. Brewery. So let's go ahead and get the brewery started up because we are dwarves after all. So, you know, this is important stuff. How about we stick you... I don't really want you to be... Um, oh, I guess we can move you. Let's go there for now. Uh, no, but our guys, our dwarves do require... Uh, we have a chemical interest. And is that the only, anyone, there's something else, isn't there? I think dwarves are alcohol dependency. So we need to ingest alcohol on a regular basis to survive. After five days without alcohol, carriers will suffer alcohol deficiency. 30 days, they fall to a coma. and 60 days, they die. So uh, it's important to, to have that. Very important. Okay, we got farming going in. Look at these trees. Fancy. I think it, whenever they like walk behind them, I think it... it let me see if it does it. I'm like this? No, it doesn't. I thought it like it was supposed to like make it to where you could see things. Never mind. Uh, some of us did come with some cool weapons. You got a pole hammer here. Um, Mangus, what do you have? Yeah, you got an axe, a hand axe, very important. So we got another uh, another pole hammer. We work pretty well equipped for the start here. Okay, we're going to get them started here. Things are getting moved in. We got a party going on already. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get our research stuff set up. So we got the main tree here with smithing and stone cutting. We begin with that. And we're going to go in the medieval tree, though, because we can get some cool things like uh, probably basic agriculture, I guess. Basic cooking gives us recipes of dishes. Pressing machine to press the juices out of fruits or wet for or away from curds. Candle making. Make candles light up the colony, getting beautiful chandeliers. Let's take some agriculture. We're on Randy Random, um, uh, losing is fun. Because we're playing the Dwarf Fortress, so of course we're doing losing is fun. Okay, I got you. Got you, Gavin. Marley, thanks for following. Pickle, thank you for following. Where's everyone? Oh, everyone should probably be sleeping in these beds out here. Yeah. Yeah. Um... We'll get them moved over here at some point. I'm just gonna make these hallways first, and then we'll get, we'll probably just put like a dormitory area in this way. Oh, they're having a party. And then we'll go deal with everything else over there. Mighty Infernus, thanks for following. Uh, also, um, I think you guys showed up a little bit late for that also, uh, the, you, you new folks. We've got orcs to our west. Um, and we've got elves, elves to our southeast. And then, uh, I don't see any dwarves around us. There's dwarves way up here. But the, uh, the green one is, is, uh, is orcs, and the yellow one here is elves. Our goal for this, this playthrough is not complete until we can march out of our dark forest, across the river, down the road to the elves, and we burn the elf town. Then, then, complete. That's, that's our, uh, that's our, our ultimate goal. If we do that, then... Nothing really else to do. We have one room world, basically, if we do that. Uh, where's party spot? It's in miscellaneous. Uh, we'll set it up in here for right now. Party spot, and I guess we can meditate there for now. We got tool racks, we got quenching buckets. Bucket full of oil used in quenching smoldering metals. Yeah, we got a grinding wheel, we've got bellows as well. Um, Cavalry spikes. I've uh, I was playing around with this a little earlier, and I only got raided by a guy with a knife, so I haven't seen any of the uh, real exciting medieval stuff. This version of the medieval mod, anyway. Everyone's sleeping out here right now. Yeah, we didn't get any beds. Well, they'll come in the mine tomorrow, and we'll be all set. Uh, let's go finish this up while they're sleeping. Um, let's see. We don't need childcare on you guys. Look, if there's kids around, we're already going to have problems. Bed rest, of course, is important. Um, 
Romello's a pretty good doctor, too. We got, we got some really good doctors to start with, and everyone loves to mine. Should we, like, set this up right now? Marmel is pretty good at stuff. Uh, Ularin is only really good at, like, mining and doctoring, but he could be our researcher. He's got some passion for it. I'm going to set him as a researcher. And then everything else has somebody doing it at some point. Um, I would like Burns to be my... Burns the Farmer. Burns is always a farmer when we play, so... Burns the Farmer. Um, Pablo can help grow, but Pablo's mostly doing our cooking. Pablo, you cook. That's his job. Tammy is pregnant. Who's Tammy? Tammy the cat? Oh, cat's explosion. <laughs> it's already happening. Grizzly Man and Krimnir. Thanks for following why is that? Why is auto mod modding that? LMAO is. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Switch. Yeah, it is kind of neat. I, I, so I picked up a, um, a start someone put in as um, Mercenary Company, was someone that someone had made on, on Steam. And I took that one and modified it for Dwarf Fortress, and it had that in there. So you start with a, a fortress. That, that whole story was like you're just like a bunch of wandering, I think, band of. Um, it was like Battle Brothers themed. That's what we've got. Why well, we have all the armor and stuff. Um, and I had the fortress there. I mean, that, that's pretty neat. I guess to keep that around. The medieval mod, it, it did change a couple things where, like the other factions that are in the game, I took out the, um, I took out like the, the main story one, you know, um, the kingdom, whatever they are. The Empire. I took the Empire out. But everyone else, even like the pirates, um, where's some here? Like the uh, House Oswin and House Soren and House Hesse. These are all added in from the medieval mod. And then, oh, and Embois and, and over there. So yeah, it does have its own things for that. I take this broken cart. What's the broken cart going to give us? Wood? I'm going to take that thing apart. Okay, so this room's done now. I'm just going to move some beds in here. Um, we'll, we'll set up, like, bedrooms in a minute. But for now, we'll just get them inside. Uh, whoops. Fix that in seconds. Is there any more? There's just two of them over there. I got a big crate there. Oh, yeah. Put that in, in here. In, um... It was going to be storage line, wasn't it? Yeah, let's 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 change that. We got a day. Let's make this storage land. I'm gonna go ahead and put storage spots in here, like that. Cause I know we have uh, some uh, some some racks over here too. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. We've got a shelf over here. Let's go ahead and get this. It's got all kinds of stuff in it already. Put that over there, and we got a bookshelf. Which we don't need that just yet. There's a just like a stack of logs. We'll move these things in a minute, but we'll just get them, like, in, in the place where we want them. We end table over there. Uh, we actually have a, a hearth already. Can I reinstall the hearth? Seems like something going to be hard to reinstall. Okay, so let's let's do some mine in here. And I think we're going to go and... I mean, we're, if we're going to do this dual fortress style, I guess we could do bedrooms. Now, when you do uh, as the... The Rimworld themed dwarves, the, the dirt moles, they have a thing about like small places, I think. These guys don't have that. But I can't play a dwarf fortress type thing without having the dwarf fortress bedrooms. So we're going to have the dwarf fortress bedrooms. Forgive me. But we're going to do it. Because it's just, it's just the way things are. You know, some things I just can't change. And that's one of them. that. Oh my God, we can get a bed in there. <laughs> can we get a bed? It's bed's a little bigger, isn't it? So we have to, go, we have to go a little bigger. Okay, we'll do a little bigger. They're going to have a bed and an end table. And then everything's great. Yeah. I'm, I'm, you, could, you could say I'm ready for the Dwarf Fortress uh, Steam release. Let's do like... So that's what? That's six. We need, we need one more. Like that. These are like luxurious dwarf bedrooms. We get two extra squares. Let's 
We'll see how it goes. If they get real cranky about it, we can do some modifying. But we're <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna see how it goes. Let's get some torches in this place. I can't see anything. We, if we look at them and they're like crying and, and like throwing big fits, then we'll modify. But for now, we'll just see how it goes. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll put in like, oh, you know what we'll do? This will be kind of our, our like our common room or whatever uh, right in here. Like that. Tables, we'll put the hearth in there and all that. <clears throat> If we do bigger, we could do a family. We could just give more space. Here, okay, okay. I'll, I'll give a little bit. And here's what we can do. We can make it to where... We've got extra space. Um, like, um... So if we need to grow, we can grow one over. that so then if we need to we can we can add an extra thing so we'll have a three by three room then they'll be fine all right we got one room done let's go ahead and get those beds moved in here again oh there's more shelves good 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 and more boxes shelves back there and boxes over there I really like, one thing I didn't realize I would like so much is the way that they've changed this the stockpile way, stockpile system. Because it used to be, and just, you can see how I've been playing Worm Worm World too long, where you build a big stockpile and you throw all your junk on the ground. Um, I like the way they got the shelves and stuff, so your stock room actually looks like a stock room and not just like a junk room, not like a hoarder's house. with just things all over the place. Uh, this one will be a little off, won't it? That's just going to be a tiny room. Maybe there'll be a prisoner room at some point. Okay, let's get one more one here. And... Be, reinstall that one over here. Okay, there's two beds. Let's go ahead and get the other beds. We don't know how to make anything uh, yet. But we know how to make um, just sleeping spots. Bed rolls, we need cloth. We don't have anything yet. There we go. A couple beds in there. We got our tables and chairs, which we may actually have, have some out here that we can grab. Uh, yeah, we do. And a bookshelf. Shelves have been my favorite. Uh, yeah, I think so. I think so. Uh, I really like it too. I didn't. I didn't even realize that was one of the changes until like halfway through playing it the first time. But yeah, it makes a huge difference. And I, it, even the, like the look of the base, because you always, when you had your base, you always had like, everything was always, always looked real nice. You know, you got your, your production rooms and your bedrooms and all that stuff was always organized. And then you always had just like a big pink square, whatever color, in the middle of your base, which is junk on the ground. And then I like how it has, how it's, I like I like the new stuff. Uh, Zahn is grumpy. What do we have? Oh, he's idle also. Uh, let me give you a job, buddy. Um, I want you to go and... We'll construct. Oh, I realize no one has construction. Let's get construction on if we have some of that. Put them to mine? Um, okay, well, you can research if you don't have nothing to do. Okay, over here. These are all done. So let's go to the cooking table and make, whip up some meals. And we'll just do this, we'll do, like, we'll just have, like, ten of these around. Actually, that's probably too many. Is it, is that, is that actually 40 meals? Is that what that is? I forget. Got some traders coming in. Uh, we're gonna get this new tech, which will give us new things also. The workbench is gonna give us veils, you know, that kind of stuff. We'll make a bow, because we need a weapon for range stuff. Um, research spot is there. Stone cutting. I'm going to go ahead and make some blocks forever. I don't care what you do with those. 
And then we've got the brewery, which I do want to go ahead and get started making some wort. Which takes berries, right? It takes berries. You know, you need hops. Okay, okay. So just do it forever. When we get hops going, I forgot to make a make a hop farm. Set those up like right over here. Probably not done working yet. Uh, hops, hops, hops. Where are they? There you are. It'd be cool if there was like armor stands that sped up pawns changing into their armor and such. <laughs> let's, let's chat with this guy. Uh, what do you got? Jump packs. I don't know about any of that. Sounds like magic. Uh, I'd like your... Uh, where's, uh, I think I'm supposed to have money. I think I'm supposed to start with money. Do we start with money? Do we leave our money laying around here? We got all kinds of stuff over here that's not been hauled yet. It's possible our money's behind that tree, but we can't see anything. A lot of, a lot of meat that's just rotting. Uh, Chaos, can you come, like, haul some stuff over here? I need everyone. Just get over here and start hauling stuff. All this, I brought all this meat because I was, I was worried I was going to, like, um, die of starvation because I, I always under bring what I need when I've got so many people. It's a little all rot. Part of the, um, it's part of the medieval mod. Is the, is this the dark forest. Okay. Where's this fella at? Oh, what do you got there? Pigs? What are you wearing on your face, buddy? Try to see if anyone comes in here with, like, guns. I haven't seen it yet, so I'm kind of worried that something I may have missed something. So we'll find out. You, go chat with Turkey here. Turkey, locust, gnat, spider. Nice. Uh, you got some. You do have some animals, huh? Okay. Well, I, um, I don't know if that was anything. I don't want your elven war mask, that's for sure. Some parkas, and I don't think it gets that, it's not get that cold here. Die is cool. No, I <laughs> stand um, I don't think I want any of your stuff. If you had something like nice, pigs are cool. Um, do pigs have to? Hmm. Do we want pigs? I don't think so. Maybe if we had like chickens or something, we could take chickens. But I don't think we want pigs. Plus, I don't have any money. Okay, so there's a stockpile room. We're gonna get, get this as... Let's go get the, the table and chair moved. Set it right in the middle there. And we'll get our kitchen kind of moved back there in like a, like a pantry of some kind. Chair there. Of course, we can make more of those. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and mine out. We'll have... This will... If that's gonna be... We don't have any power, so we can't do like cooling of things. We'll be like a kitchen spot. So we'll, we'll dig out over here and make... We'll make a kitchen. Plenty big for a... It's too big probably for a kitchen. That big enough for a kitchen? We could fit a station in there. Uh, actually, I think we need a lot more stuff for... Let's do it bigger. Because we have to get the grindstone and all that kind of stuff. So a kitchen over there and then we'll have our... Um, our stock room on this side. Somebody's grumpy. Oh, recreation. Right. Food storage real quick. We'll be right there. And we can have like a little walkway here for these guys. <clears throat> Kenneth, thanks for following. I remember watching one of my old Dwarf Fortress streams when Lycanthropy broke out. Your dwarves started disappearing and you eventually lost the fort to them. Yeah, I've lost a few forts to Lycanthropy. With the um, nosy levels. Um, there is a mine, though, in this somewhere. I think we, we must have to research it. But there is a mine in this mod. 
Um, I forgot what I was going to say. I was going to say something, but I forgot what it was. Never mind. Let's get a, a stockpile over here. Throw it over here. These rocks out of here. Okay. Stone man here can probably get to work. I should probably put him over there. <clears throat> oh uh, yeah. Uh, I've seen people play this where it's more of a Sim City kind of game. With this, this is what uh, I think the the biggest part. Well, another big part of the update, the new update, is with kids and like school stuff. Um, you could really play this like The Sims, you know, um, very easily because you you could play it on easy, like on basic difficulty. You don't have to worry about raids. Um, you don't worry about like things going running amok like they do typically in Dwarf Fortress because you can just play it um, peaceful like. I think it would be. I think it'd be pretty fun. A gift. You give me a knife and a bow. Well, thanks. Uh, who here likes to shoot things? Zon loves to shoot things. Zon, why don't you go pick up that bow? You get a cool weapon there, but pick that thing up. We have low food. Do we have low food? We just don't have things pulled over here. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I want everyone first top priority hall. Just get everything moved over there, please. Okay, go get some stuff hauled in here. Does he? Oh, you're a hunter too. Okay. There we go. Run out of food, we can go and hunt. Uh, we can pick up some berries as well. Um, we'll get our a big like a line of of barrels over here also. Uh, I can move this right. Um, the brewery. Yeah, let's put the brewery back over here. Right there. And we're going to move our kitchen back there. Stash it like that. Yeah, why not? Stash that over there. We'll get some lights over there, too. Um, we need a butchery, uh, like a chopping block. Butcher's block. We need a... Um, furnace is used to smell ores. Anvil, of course. I don't know what that's for. There's our fermenting barrels. I don't know what the difference is. We got a fermenting barrel and a rustic fermenting barrel. I'm not sure the difference. Rustic. Fermenting uh, wort and ale. Okay. What about the other? Whoops. What about the other one? Various things in the products. Not limited to fermenting a specific thing. You could call it a universal fermenter. Ah, that's the, that's the good stuff. Okay. Which way is forward? That way. We'll do four of them for right now. We'll get that started up. Get some more of these things. People are probably going to start wanting some doors in their bedrooms. So let's build some of those. I want the rustic doors because it's so much cooler. Also slab doors. There we go. <clears throat> Elf weapons. Well, I know, I know, I know. Uh, this stuff's going to spoil like immediately because we're not bringing it in. I brought so much food. We're just look at all the stuff we've got up here. Look, there is silver up here. Everyone's sleeping right now. Burns. Get the Holland. Pablo, eat meat. No, get the Holland. You can get like a wagon or something. <clears throat> okay, so we'll have kitchen over here. We'll have like common room this way. We'll have food storage over here, and the barrels can be there. And uh, and we'll put some more shelves and all that stuff in there for the food storage. And then there's a pole hammer on there. We've got a whole bunch of wood now. All these trees getting chopped. 
the hops are not growing. My, uh, my farmer is slacking. Oi, oi, oi. Let me go ahead and get this set up. And just put in here as... It's important that, that food goes in here. Meals. All that stuff. Yeah, baby food. Yeah, all, all these. I don't care what's back. Yeah, yeah. All, all the all the food stuff. And medicines. Apple mints. What else do we have? Grape must. Crushed grapes. Oh, yeah. Food inside, indoors. Um, another thing is, I haven't done a base like this since I realized that because we're in like a um, under a mountain, we get a we do get a temperature bonus, uh, a temperature like consistency bonus. Yeah, so this one can do beer, ale, and wine. Okay. Over here, well, uh, Lauren thinks you can uh, give your faction a name. What do we call ourselves? We call ourselves. Oh, what do we call ourselves? Um, what's a, what's a good name for our dwarf tribe? A settlement name is is. Um, what do you got tonight with that one name? Um, Tinty's uh, armpit. Or uh, Tinty's. Um, yeah, that's that's good. That's good. That's good. And then our but our faction name is who are we gonna call ourselves? Um, Urist. Urist home. That's kind of backwards, isn't it? Faction. On Tinty Home, we call our, uh, is the name of our, uh, yeah. And then our name of our faction, Nook's Latest Sacrifices. Elven Flame. Ooh, that's good. El Elven, I don't know if we want the word Elven in our name, though. We're just going to be, like, um, Beard Flame. We're going to call our, that's our faction. We are Beard Flame, living at On Tinty Home. There we go. Elven and Goblin Appreciation Society. <laughs> when all meat's all rotten away, I got so much food and they're gonna waste it all. Who's what's what's the deal, buddy? Pablo, what's the deal, Pablo? With a name like that, such a dwarven name. What's the wrong, buddy? Oh, he's frail. Yeah, he ate some soup. You like that? Provide some warmth. Uh, night owl in the daytime. Oh yeah, I didn't check your schedules. Uh, who here is a is a night owl? Uh, this one. Night owl is just you. So my farmer, right? Are you my farmer? No, you're my cook. My cook works at night. Okay, it's really hard to sleep because it always smells good. I wish it would automatically do this for our uh, night owl folks. So I want you to sleep starting at like 8. There we go. Females are happy. Alright. There we go. Is that? I thought that was uh, was that? What what noise is that? Ah, doors are being made. Okay, good. Okay, so we got doors. Uh, we've got it. We can get get this this hearth moved, which is gonna be nice for our uh, yeah, right over uh, right over here I think. Oh, right right here on this wall. Yeah, there we go. That's nice. We got another box over here can get moved. 
put that one in in here. And what else is back here? I can't see anything because there's trees in the way. There's a grate there, more doors. Uh, there is a bookshelf. Put our research bench, research, a research hole. And then we've also got a end table, which doesn't do me any good unless it's like by a bed, right? I don't know where to put it. We'll put it there. My mushroom soup is rotting away. Uh, do we have the ability to put in... Oh, we don't. We can't make those coolers. Okay. All right. We have some research started up already. So this new agriculture is going to give us millstones and gardening boxes, garlic plants, lentils, mushrooms, onions, and plowed soil. Hmm. Orchestral hovel. Mm. Mm -hmm. We got stuff pulled in yet? Um, nope. A lot of stuff's gonna rot. Well, that's put the damper on the whole survival thing. Plenty of ingots. Uh, it's just some steel ingots as well around here, around somewhere. We have granite blocks. I'm, there's one thing in here that I, I'm not sure about yet. Um, which was, where was it? Must be in production or in, must be storage. Yeah, bricks. Bricks that are stacked in an efficient manner to save more space. That's cool. Let's put a brick spot. Um, that's my that's my my builder. Let's let's like stick it over here. Meat hooks, tall metal frame with several hooks hanging from chains. A simple crank allows hoisting. Yada yada. I'm gonna need some meat hooks in here. Food baskets, mini granary for storing raw food and plant matter. Sharpening weapons increases work speed when placed near medieval workbenches. This is a workbench. I will put a uh, um, a grinding wheel next to it. You know, he's going to want all this stuff, isn't he? He's going to want a tool rack also. Put it on the back wall, like right, like there. Yeah. And then we'll put the, uh, the not the bellows, but the grant. Yeah, well, actually, we need the bellows too. Grinding wheel will be right there. The bellows will also assist. Seems kind of silly to have a bellows right there. What's a bellowing? What's this guy making at the, at the workbench? Oh, just a short bow. That's it. Until we learn new things. Dr. Mac Daddy. <laughs> Thanks for following. Uh, Nathan the Warg is not set up for training. Let's get Nathan trained to, trained to guard and attack anyway. To get new beds, um, we can grow like um, some sort of cloth to get bed rolls. That's it. Until we find something else. Have I been hauled in yet? Let me change my my. I gotta been hauled in at the moment. So let's change my builder, which is Mangus. Mangus, you build things. Things need built, you build it. <clears throat> there we go. We only got, only got three things left. We finally got things hauled in. It, it all rotted in our hands as we walked back to the base. But we got it. The rocks have been hauled over here. It's very dirty in here. We need someone just to get in here and start cleaning. That's going to be... Mangus. When you're not constructing, you're gonna go and do some cleaning, okay? Place is a dump. I 
wonder where I get rustic furniture from. Where, what, where in the research tree is that? There it is. Rustic furniture, like hay beds and tables. Ah, hay beds. Ah, uh, yeah. That's an idea. Um, let me wait when we get my that tech, and I can grow new things. Let's grow a bunch of stuff. Uh, you know what? I don't mind one hall. I like it. Everything gets moved around quickly. Um, there's no more like I should have known a long time ago. One hall is great. So you can allow fresh, but that's you're not, you're not gonna allow anything else. You don't start with anything else. Or is that? Yeah, you know, yeah. Yeah, you can carry food. You can carry food as well, and then you are carrying oh nothing. Weapons. Not oh, that. I want you to carry just meals. Meals is fine in there. Put our meals in a box. That's very dwarf-like, I think. So we're on di very difficult, di uh, very difficult difficulty. So we should probably get some sort of defenses set up. So let's put in a uh, a little bit of. Cavalry spikes, organized collection of stakes designed to keep intruders out. Walking through spikes can hurt pawns. A plague. Come on now. Two of your mercenaries have gotten sick from the plague. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. Um, you know, there's, there's, there's sometimes it's it's okay. Like, Rainy Ram's great. Rainy Ram has all kinds of exciting things. Other times it's like, you know, it could have been something like a little more interesting. Let me just let my people die. You can chop this, please. I need to get this done. The Dwarf McDonald's. That's right. Excellent idea. Um, so um, I have this 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 Polish friend who is a uh, a sound technician and a Czech one too, and a Czech one too. There you go. There's your dad joke. Uh, I need to get somebody to get this medicine quickly. Who has the... Who has the... Um, yeah, get Mar Marmel attended to. And then... Mangus. Is that it? Marmel and Mangus. Hey, I smell. How's it going? Uh, no, no conversation mod. This needs a new name. Harley, do you want to be a... Uh, do you want to be a warg? Or Gavin? We need to name a cat. We need... we got two cats to name and a warg. I could put in Goblin Friend, but I'm not doing that. Or Gnome Impersonator. Gnome Impersonator, that's a good cat name. Let's get some animal spots to get them in here. They can sleep behind the behind the beer. Like minor. Uh Burns isn't the best doctor. I suppose we should have someone that Oh yeah, Burns is a good doctor. Never mind. Okay, we get Mangus taken care of. Mangus, I don't need you to die. Please. How you doing? No dying from the plague. I almost I almost brought real medicine so I wouldn't have to deal with plagues. Let me set this up as a medical bed. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's good. Uh, I forgot how to do it. Uh, is it in law? How do you change the cat name? I forget how to change the names. Oh, change change your name, Tammy. That was in here. Is he on an ice sheet biome? Oh man. There it is. Uh what was it? Elf Biter. Excellent. Excellent name. Okay. And we'll do brandy wine is um 
is um um gnome gnome um gnome nip like cat nip but gnome nip there you go Matt Matchless that's 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 from you Okay, everyone, how's the uh, how's the disease looking? Let's, let's take a look at this. Uh, not Nathan, Mangus. Look at Mangus, Mangus. Is he up? Oh, there he is. That's all the name. I thought it was name. Mangus, Mangus. How you feel? You don't have the immunity. Marmelo does have the immunity. Okay. Lewin, thanks for following. Two layers of wall. I built this. I built these rooms pretty small. So if they complain about their rooms being too small, then we can um, fi fix that. I want you to go and actually here. Let me set you up. A little worried about this. Mangus bed rest. Marmelo bird bed rest. Go eat and go get to bed. Mangus, get some bed time. Hey, Skull, how's it going? So I did, I did, I did the two by three, and uh, as as a compromise, uh, I added a little gap there just in case they panic with the small room. It was an awful bedroom. Other than that, though, he had a party. No, we I didn't pick the undergrounder ideology. Um, I plan on getting there. I planned on it, but I didn't. Um, but we did the evolving thing, so I think we can add it in there. I actually don't remember how that works. <clears throat> Say, so, uh, end table needs to get moved over there, and that's. I think it's it. This map is very uh, full of all kinds of things, including cars. More cars. What's over there? Rocks? What are these? Rocks? What are you? Huge herding herbivore of unknown or origins. Large horns that gore attackers. Are these, um, are these from the mod or are these in the game now? Where's the training time? You guys trainable? Advanced, huh? Oh. Uh, blinking over here. Where was it? I saw it. Um, it's a new thing now with a new update is... Where'd it go? I missed it. Uh, there it is. Uh, these ex ex exo strider midsections. So it's got a transponder in it, which... Um, there's a still-functioning transponder. If you extract the transponder, you get a, you can decrypt it to gather information. I think it's like a tech thing. I haven't got it, done it before. Uh, however, it blows up when you, when you break it. So you have to be careful. Taking that thing apart. Okay. Um, what are you doing? Hold on some wood. I'll go ahead and just clean up in here. Let's get this place clean, and so then that'll help the, the immunity as well, hopefully. Oh, he's good. He's ahead of the immunity now. Good, good. Was that... Oh, he's not, though. Right, he's the one who's a little behind. I guess maybe, maybe it's catching up, though. Oh, is it is it the mech? Okay. He's catching up. Okay, good. We'll just make sure we keep him keep him taken care of. Hopefully. Um yeah, just make that stuff forever. And you can make it um can you do anything else here? Or just just that? Where do we make the other stuff at then? If that just makes It just makes it out of the hops. How do you make the other stuff? Is that a tech I need to learn? Or do I just... Um, yeah, either way, I'm going to need... Wart. Wart. Hmm. Cooking table is fine. I'll get a quick in a minute as long as he doesn't... Uh, well, he's, not, he's that guy there. Bedtime for him. Before you go to bed, 
Come clean up some dirt real quick. <clears throat> That's what... So when I did uh, like a little test of this to make sure everything was not broken, uh, I played with the the dirt moles or whatever was in that comes with 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 the game now and um there's cramped interior and um at the last minute i found this this fantasy one this dwarf mod so i switched over and so uh things are a little different but it's it's all right we're gonna have to get we got to get this this brewery working quick because well Start dying if we don't. Um, we need to get that, those hops done. Burns, are you working on that? He's chopping them trees down. Get them hops growing. Enough booze around here. People are starting getting real cranky. Uh, let me look at research here. Something plants. Griffin berry. No, oh, no, just a fruit. You make mince juice in here. There's the presser. Just give us a millstone. Maybe that'll do something for us. Grinding raw plants. Yeah, so we need... Um, we have to... We have alcohol dependency, so we have to have alcohol at some point. Otherwise, we start dropping in the comas and things. So we'll get these hops grown eventually. Huma, Inufix, thank you very much for the gift sub. And a hey, cap slip. How's it going? Uh, D and D night. Uh, we uh, I killed a player. <laughs> it was kind of a rough night. I um, it's mostly my fault. Uh, I I. The the healer was was away was wasn't playing last last night, uh, a couple nights ago, and um, he's a he's a twi uh, 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 twilight healer, so he's 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 very a very strong healer, and uh, I um, I oh I undercompensated I I didn't compensate enough for just how important he is to the party. And typically we have kind of a thing where if somebody doesn't show up, then we can keep playing. And then the um, the person who's not there just sort of like, the, that, that character just kind of steps away for a minute. So we don't, I don't I don't want anyone like, I've had it before where someone will like play the character and then they get the character killed. And that's no cool. That's that's not cool. You don't want to like miss D&D &D for one night and then find out Frank got your, your character killed. So, um, oh, that's what the problem is. So, um, yeah, uh, we got a dead guy, basically. Edge, thanks for following. Look at that so Mangus is having a bad time. Mangus, I don't blame you, buddy. But you do have, you have met your, uh, your immunity. So that's good. That's good. We got one hop in the ground. Good. Yeah, it's neat. It's the it adds the um, dark forest um, biome. It's pretty neat. Break risk. What's what's with everyone's break risks? Let's take a look here. I know I know I know what yours all about. Burns, you don't have a bed anymore, so that could cause you some problems. Just throw those in there. Burns, wake up. Pretend to Mangus and get get to bed. Mangus, how you feeling, buddy? It's cutting it real close. You tended to. Hope we got a good a good tend. We got a mm, an, an okay tend. Really cutting it close. What are you bringing in? What is that? You brought a fox in? Oh, you put it on a meat hook. Look at that. Stuck a fox on a meat hook. 
Okay, the butcher uh, thing. Make sure you are butchering. Lindworm. Pack of Lindworm have wandered into the area. We'll leave after a while. Be warned, Lindworm are extremely dangerous, but are highly sought after for their robust fur and majestic horns. Oh my. Hello. How tough is it? You got a bad back. <laughs> it's real rough if you're a snake and you got a bad back. Is this the thing from the mod? I don't know these. How do I know how tough it is? I don't know my numbers. Chat, help me out. Um, where is his, where is his, his fighty stuff? We could, like, tame him and have his eggs. Melee DPS 7.79. Two, two second cooldown. He's got, a uh, 27 damage. Armor penetration is 41. So let's say we look at, like, Burns. Uh, Burns has got a mace here. We got some deficiency going on with our alcohol. We're gonna have to get that figured out real quick. Um, I'm gonna look at, I look at, what do we look at for his stats? Three point three two. It's like the same. What do you think? Bear is five point three eight, huh? It was pretty tough. 28% armor penetration. His was like 40, 41%. So he could, we'd probably kill us. Maybe a few of us. What do we do? Do we just let him wander around? Or do we go get him? We got two people down. If he comes, if he comes to our, to our door, then we'll kill him. If he just wanders by, we'll let him, we'll let him wander by. Be cool to tame that thing, though. It'd be real cool if we could tame that thing. What's the eighty percent chance of, of of attacking us? What do we do about what do we do about this this lack of of booze? I underestimated my my need for that. Um, this isn't gonna grow anytime soon. Especially since he's not even growing it. Hope for some traders, I suppose. I don't really know what to do. Keep an eye on this guy. Mangus is having a real bad day. But he's getting immunity. I think a lot. Thanks for following. We got a lot of chairs that need made here. We'll, uh, we'll think about other things. Like chairs. I need to move that over, don't I? Um, oh, wait, oh, wait. It can be here. Yeah, that one needs to be a different one. Doesn't matter which way this stuff is facing. There and there. Yeah, it's neat. With the start, it gave it gave us this castle. It was already like fully we had, we had some shelves in there and some beds. Pretty neat. If he does, are we sleeping now? Oh, we could get him while he's sleeping. Okay, I can't resist. I'm sorry, but we're a bunch of dwarves, and there's a there's a there's a beast out there that needs killing. Uh, Zahn, I'm gonna give you something a little cooler because I know we've got a better weapon around here somewhere. Pole hammer. Get the Warhammer instead. I don't know if we should be running out there with our with our guys that are like wounded. <clears throat> a wingless, tailless dragon, exactly, with a bad back, <laughs> which is what that's yeah, perfect one to go get. Uh, when do you need your treatments? Make sure we get that taken care of before you die. Can we tend to in five hours, and in three hours you're almost immune. Okay, I'm not gonna get him killed, am I? Like these guys? I don't know, maybe. Okay, let's go get them. Alright, dwarves. 
Time to go marching. Everyone's a little cranky, a little grumpy, you know? It's, like, been rough, but, um... Timberwolf. Look, buddy. Got him. Okay. Good job. Good job. Good practice run. Okay. I'm not a save scummer. I, I, I do not save scum. I, I don't like it. It's just something I'd like to talk about for a minute. Mm -mm. Okay. All right, snake. Dragon, dragon. The, the stories we tell, this is a dragon, okay? Everyone remember this. Dragon. Marmelo, get over here. You're a little slow. All right, everyone, you ready? Okay. Oh, whoops. Uh, whoops. Whoops. Uh, everybody kill that. Lindworm Revenge. Yeah, he just chewed on Chaos. Lindworm bashed Chaos in the torso. Uh, Chaos got him in the neck, leaving a horrific wound. Where's his health at? Mm, he's a little tough. Chaos is getting chewed on pretty good. He's he's moving his bites around, though. We gotta hit him. Rats coming to watch. You looking? We're, we're not doing much damage to him. Can we hit him a little harder, please? Maybe a few extra hits. Oh, we got him! Incapacitated. Um, man, I'd love to tame this thing. <laughs> yeah, just kill it. Get it. I got kind of lucky because he was, uh, he went down like halfway in there. Oh, nice. Session I've already ran the DM. I allowed my group to walk into a night hack home. Designed it as a trap to force him into a hypercube-shaped pocket dimension. It's good stuff. Okay, let's let's everyone have an eat. I don't know why uh, why Twitch is my mod is is um, the Twitch mod is is yes family friendly please, but the Twitch mod is a little overactive today. Okay, cloud watching. Um, you don't haul. Burns, will you uh, will you haul that lindworm in? We should just eat it. Just eat it as it is right now. Pablo. <laughs> You're late to the fight, buddy. You, you missed it. How's everyone feeling? Chaos, how you feeling, buddy? Uh, you just got a little bruised. Pablo got was late to the, the battle. Looks like um, Marmelo got immunity. Walking to the battle. Walking to the fight against the dragon. He developed immunity. That's how important it was to him. Um, he's gonna die in 19 hours, though, if he doesn't get patched up. Mangus, can you, um... How are you feeling, buddy? You'll be alright. I think Burns carried that, driving his right fist wildly. Yeah, where's the fight going here? Burns compared Chaos to a demon. That's quite an insult. Wielding his mooring star fearfully, viciously slammed the lindworm in the neck. We've got the neck pretty good. Okay, we'll get in here and we'll get everyone healed up. Uh, oh, I never got a, a name for uh, for Nathan here. So uh, Ga Gavin, I think you've been, I think Gavin has been an animal before. So Gavin, you are now a warg again. I don't know how much they eat if you tame them. I don't know. I'm intrigued, though. Okay, let's go. Can we hang him on the meat hook? Oh, great. Burns, I need you to tend to people. Uh, don't go too far. Um, stay here. You got some tending to do. Okay, so now tend to chaos. Chaos just really just got a little beat up, a little bruised. He's all right. Were you a cow last time? I couldn't. I couldn't remember what you were last time. Okay. 
Who needs rescue? Megus, what are you doing out there? Oh, the plague is extreme. He needs tending to immediately. Who's my other my other good doctor? Oh, everyone's hurt. Uh, go tend to him, and then we'll tend to you. Real close. That was real close. <laughs> that was real close. He's fine. He's fine. Just don't tell him the numbers, and he'll be fine. He doesn't need to know how close he was to dying. Uh, where's Burns at? Burns, no time for prayer. We all have alcohol deficiency. We're going to be in trouble. Whatever was it, was it? So after five days, we suffer a deficiency. After 30 days, we fall to a coma. So we've got 30 days. we got some time. Not a lot of time. Okay, but we made it through the plague, though. I'm kind of surprised about that. I didn't think that was going to happen. Make sure we get the uh, the worm cut up. Worm with a Y. Chaos, you're right there. Just a few bruises, but you got some band-aids on it. You're good. Um, no. Because he is a he is a doctor. He might as well patch himself up. You too. Um, let's see. If we we could go on like a trek and try to trade and get some alcohol or some something to. Some hops. We just gotta buy some hops. This isn't getting grown. Pablo's supposed to be cooking, but you're gonna be growing as well. Pablo. Oh, he's sleeping, right? He's a grower. Or he's a nighttime guy. Burns, just get this in the ground, please, and then then you can go rest. Burns, I'm sorry. Just, just, you just smack it. No, no, no. Get it. Burns, you're tough. No one's gonna get there in time. By the time he's... We do start with armor. I don't think I showed this. We're all geared out. Pretty good. Okay, okay. Okay. We're just getting chewed up pretty good here. Okay, we go, I got him. Okay. If you're suggesting that I go trade with the elves, well, I don't know what to say. They're way down here. We got orcs to our west. I don't, they, they don't like us. I don't think anyone around here likes us, except for the elves, maybe. Yeah, everyone hates us. The elves are okay with us. For now. That's it. <laughs> That's the price you pay for gardening. <laughs> uh, a little bit of an insulting spree. Uh, he's in a bad mood, so he's going to go around and doing it. And he's ravenously hungry. Well, then go eat something. Uh, Pablo, you're going to make him cry. Some wolves around. We got. Have we cut this guy up yet? I forget who my cook is. Cook is Pablo. Right. Always Pablo. Whatever job it is, always Pablo. Man, don't yell at him. He's planting our stuff. He's hauling things. Burns, you got patched, right? Oh, Burns didn't get. Why didn't you get patched? Burns, patch yourself. I thought they patched themselves on their own. When that was marked. Okay. Now he's going to get infected. Is everyone else okay? Let's take a quick look here. I had this problem last time I played where somebody didn't tend to themselves and they died. Okay. All good.
We may have to go on a on a walk, but there's no one really to go to. Who are we going to go to to trade with? I guess it's in a daze. We've got... Uh, oh, here's one over here. These guys might have something. We could try to go there and hope they have... we got two different factions there. It's... That's way too far out, isn't it? I was thinking I was down here. That's way too far. We can't go across the mountains. Nothing, nothing friendly nearby. Pablo, get up. That area is sewed. It's going to take so long. 13%. Stop walking away. This is going to give us... And then we got to put it in, in the barrels. We're not going to make it. There's no way. We got so many potatoes, but we don't know how to make anything out of the potatoes. I don't know what to do. There's got to be something we can do to make something out of the potatoes. Let's try this one also. The the rustic one. Uh, what other things we ha do we have here? I mean, these are all just like. Not what we want. Yeah, vodka. I've got I've got a brewery right here, yeah. Brewery can only make wort. But it has to be made out of hops. I know there's ways of doing other things. Well obviously there is, because we there's wine and stuff. But I don't know where it's at. I thought that would do it for us. Steak with wine. Is it intermediate where we can do it? I don't know where that comes in. Basic cooking doesn't do it. Look at what so with, with advanced cooking we can do steak with wine. Where do we do wine? That's what I was kind of thinking, but it just does apple juice and apple mints. So I am not sure. Yosef, thanks for following. Uh, beggars hope for charity. Group of poor travelers pushing looking for help. They're looking for 165 silver. One silver so I can buy back a friend. Um, I can just give it to you. Or I can kill you and arrest you. How many of them? Oh, you're all right there. What do you think I am? I'm not giving you my uh, money. Get out of here. Do you have any... Um, you don't have any, like, booze on you, do you? You got medicine, do you? And clubs? And a lot of you are, uh, have nothing? Two people with medicine. Where are you guys from? You're from West... Jerowiston. Who is that? We just take him out. Is it under the main tech tree? Um, I know there is a, a brewery down here. We have, we have brewing. Um, whatever it is. I don't know. Not quite sure where it, where it's at. Who 
is almost almost done. Well, sort of sort of almost. I'm real tempted to just take these guys out. Um, I'm not sure we would really gain anything other than we'd get a couple medicine out of it and make someone real mad at us. Probably not the best idea to make everyone mad at us, especially for where I'm on a traitor. So maybe we shouldn't do too much killing. Mm. There's cider. Ah, oh, there we go. So brewing gives us that. So we need cider. Which does... Apple juice fermented a few days developed into alcohol content. Consume enough cider to make you drink. Uh, what does it take? It just takes apples? We need that. We can grow hops, but we're not going to get our hops done fast enough. Okay, there we go. And then there's ale. Okay, there we go. There we go. I just didn't go far enough down. All right. So let's get cider. And whoever my researcher is, um, Ulleran is, yeah, your research buddy. Wake up and research. And he already is. Okay, get to work. We gotta get that done. We gotta get, uh, one of these will take, maybe it'll take berries, I don't know. Hops only take five days or so to grow. Oh yeah. Well, if Burns wasn't so busy just laying around staring at the sky, we could have him in the ground. Both these are our hops spots. Isn't there a mushroom one you can do also? Like a mushroom drink? Yeah, that's that's the other problem. We gotta we gotta grow it and then we gotta ferment it. Mangus is having a real, real tough time. He's been so he was insulted nine times. Also ate without a table. Why? What do you think we'd call this? Oh, we cut up the, the worm and I missed it. Oh man, I wanted to see it. Food's not a problem anymore, I don't think. We're pretty well set. How do we know what's in the crate? Pablo's running wild. He's fed up with civilization. He's realized that wild creatures are always free. So I had to leave your faction and live with the animals. Have to tame them or arrest them to get them back. Because he was a daytime guy. Um, Pablo, you know what, buddy? Uh, where's for prisoners? Where is he? He's right there. Alright, Burns. Just get everybody. Can we go arrest this guy? Uh, how do I how do I tell them to arrest him? Everybody come stand over here just in case. Hey, Galactic Red Dragon, how's it going? Just in case he gets antsy. Okay. Throw him in there. We'll get Pablo back. The contents tab. Ah, oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, nothing. Okay. I wonder why they're not putting things in there. Putting them on the ground there. This one's this one's not set up. The other one is. All right, Pablo. Uh, I want to make sure that we image farm. We want to um, where's the button for uh, I don't want to execute you. How do I get him to be um, to uh, join us? Can we do it in here? It's in prisoner options. Yeah, but there's only five. Isn't there supposed to be more of those? It'd 
Maybe because he's still because he's still running wild, he's gotta wait for him to calm down. He's already converted. Uh, convert is just for ideology. It said, "Oh, oh, I can't, I can't." It said, "It said I can, I can imprison him if I want to. I guess if I want to do other things." Uh, okay, there's the tame button. All right, Pablo, we need you back, buddy. Some time. This place is a dump. Look at how dirty it is in here. Let me get this dumping stockpile. Expand it a bit. I'm gonna move it out like this. We're gonna use our dumping stockpile as kind of like a uh, as a as a wall. Let's go. I was gonna put in those barricades. I do think I still would like to do that. Like maybe just like right in here. Cavalry spikes. Like that. Yeah, like a wild animal. Okay. Uh, priest roll unfulfilled. That's right. Um, yeah, we haven't done any of that stuff yet. Let me get some Marmello. I'm going to assign it. It went to you. So. Oh, yeah, no altar. Oh, yeah. I always forget about this ideology. We'll put it in, in here, I guess. Ritual spot we'll put down uh, just like right, right there in front of the fire. And then we'll stick... Does that have to be steel ingots? I guess a, le a lectern can go in there, too. There we go. So with that there, we can do it now, right? Marmelo, I need you to tell us some things. Actually, we'll give it to Chaos. Or, um... Yeah, Marmelo can do it. So Marmelo, I'm going to make you my... My Prime Minister. <laughs> um, well, it says... Maybe we should do this one. The Fieldist Priest... Heads the rituals and personally counsels believers. Let's do that one. Marmella will do it. Pablo's not gonna not gonna participate this time. Everyone, come over here and uh, let's let's go have a chat and install our ritual leader. Let me people happy. Skull spike. It's exactly what you think it is. Okay, roll change success. That'll actually make people happy having having that. We got um attended a party, yeah. Uh, well, I thought it would. You want, to, you want you want the apparel, which is what? What is the apparel? You want a cape? I don't want to do capes. Where, where do we make stuff at? It's here, isn't it? I can't make capes. I'll make you a veil. Hundred percent. A party. That's that's what we need, Marmello. We need more parties. I like that. I like the sound of that. Any more other like free stuff out here? Like, there isn't just like wild hops growing around, is there? Cause that would be pretty handy. Uh, Marmello decided to have a party, and now he's gonna have a sadistic rage. He's grown, flown into a sadistic rage. This is our our leader here. He's going to vent his anger on the prisoners. He's so mad, he doesn't have his cape. He's going to go over there and attack the prisoner. Okay, we got a raccoon coming in. Let's let's use these uh, these barricades. Here we go. <laughs> Get behind the barricade for, these, for this raccoon coming in. Uh, leave Pablo alone. <laughs> Marmello, get a hold of yourself. What'd you do that for?
Hmm. Hobble's no longer bloodlusting and all that. Right, go, go get that raccoon, everybody. Got him. Is there, are you mad too? Oh. Another one? Give me more there. Okay. Another one? I missed how many it said. I thought it said one. Dawn's hungry. Okay. Any more? No, we're fine. We're fine. All right. Uh, Marilla's going to go run over there. Mangus, will you come and help Pablo out? And then go tame him while you're at it. And then whoever wants to do the taming, which is going to be the warden. Or is that... It's a handle animal, isn't it? Put that up there. Okay, so handling animals is your thing. Uh, grow if you've got time. Break risk. Marmelo's having a bad day. Man, you're our leader. Look, why don't you go and, like, reassure yourself? I'm sorry I didn't get you a cape. I didn't know it was going to be that big a deal. All right. What 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 else is is what do we what can we do to let's make this place look nice? So if it looks nice, then they'll be much happier. That's what I'm thinking. Um, we could go. We could move everyone that's not doing anything and very important to clean. So we just get the place clean looking. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Let's do a quick clean spree. Let's make sure that our zone, our home zone, is is only right here. And nothing else. Okay. So we'll clean this place as much as we can. Let's go ahead and get some things like nice, nice things. Um, we don't have a lot of nice things. We can put in some floors. We've got... We do have a lot of wood. Just do wood floors. I don't have a thousand wood. I'll go ahead and mark it. We should probably should be smooth in it. Smooth those and make them look a little nicer. It's going to take too much time, though. But let's get the wood done. Uh, there's a lot of trees out here we can chop. That'll help bring in some wood that we can get these floors done. And that'll make it a little nicer. At least we get it clean, go uh, nice and clean. Um, I don't care about shrines any. What can we do to make things look a little nicer in here? Uh, plants. Make them out of a bone plant pot. Yes, please. Yeah, definitely want a bone plant pot. Plant pot. Uh, we could also, you know, we could do our. Ex we'd expand this stuff. Like, let's look at Mangus here. Awful bedroom. It's not like cramped. He's not getting the cramped thing. It's only when he wakes up. It is awful. It's because it's it's dirty. Uh, well, they should be clean before they haul now. These guys don't think they have the dark light thing. No. How's that, uh, how's that tech coming along? That was our cook that just died, or that is running away. So I'll have to have another cook. It's going to be Marmello, I think. Yeah, we'll leave it like that. Um, I want... Oh, whoops. Keep you researching. we got to get that, that tech done. Quicker. There's things I can there. Is there things I can do to help the research bench? Like some, uh, these I think are all for workbenches. Is 
Does it want to help out my, my research spot any? I don't think so. Okay, lots of cleaning going on in here. Wolf meat is rotting away. Yeah. Oh, we have a baby cat. Kitten. Wait, we have two baby cats? We have two baby cats. Oh, there we go. Give me another. Give me two cat names. Like, um, good dwarven cat names. Breakfast and dinner. Okay, that's good. Yep, that's it. <laughs> there we go. Those are cats. Whiskers make whiskers make friskers. Yeah, keep the cats away so they don't lick their feet. <laughs> Marmel, what's wrong with you? You hurt your foot. Yeah, because you're busy kicking Pablo over there. Pablo, did you ever get tended to, buddy? How are you feeling? You got you got punched a bunch. Murist. Murist. I need another, I'm gonna get another second research bench. This, this sitting here which waiting for research is killing me. So we need more researching spots. Two more researching spots. Uh, and I want more researchers. We've got you working on it. Burns is busy with the growing and all that. Uh, but Chaos is, is able to do it. So Chaos, when you're not handling uh, Pablo, then you go over there and you do some research. We have another one as well. I think Zon's gonna, it's gonna be Zon's job. He doesn't do anything. Okay, three people on researching. Low food. Well, that's not too big a deal because we got plants. We got potatoes coming in. We're gonna have a ton of potatoes coming in real soon. And there's a bunch of animals around here that can be. I think. Uh, those are rocks things. Oh, it's the only animals out here is rocks. There's a, of, there's a bunch of berries that can be picked as well. Nobody's set on plant cuts uh, very high. Burns can do it. So he'll grow. When he's not growing, he'll go plant cut. Then he'll go do whatever else. <clears throat> I like to. Um, I like to give you guys a little uh, little advice uh, during the um, for these dad jokes. Uh, I'm going to tell you the dad joke in a minute here because I, I got, there's an ad playing at the moment. So when the ad's done, I'll tell the dad joke. So, no worries. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to. These are dad jokes for everyone, not just subscribers. <clears throat> Couple of raccoons we can eat, uh, which again we don't have a cook. Um, Marmelo's supposed to be doing it. What are you doing, Marmelo? No, it's oh, having a good time. Probably necessary to go have a good time. Okay, get the butcher in. So Zon and Chaos should also be over here working on this stuff. There's chaos over there. Okay, there we go. Now the research should be moving. Burns is having a bad day. Burns, look at all the stuff you've planted, though. You've done so good. Awful barracks. Chemical starvation. Ugh, slipped in the heat. Is it hot in here? It's pretty warm. This thing's not running, is it? Can we, like, um... 
Yeah, we cook in there, can't we? Is this heating us up, you think? Or you think it's okay? Pretty hot in here. How do I tell them uh, just for bid? Is that what we do? It is a gather spot. So yeah, that's cool. I'd rather you not, not use it, though. Uh, is the ads over? Okay, okay. The, the the dad joke. Sorry, I was holding off for the ads to be over. <clears throat> uh, so, uh, for those of you, uh, some little advice for you. Uh, if if you're scrounging through your emails, there's a thing going on later uh, around for emails. And um, if you notice that you get an email offering you some processed pork, gelatin, and salt in a can, beware, because it might be spam. No, that that's it. That that was real dumb. That was, that was that was that was one of the worst. No good. No good. What do you call uh, a fear of giants? Fee fi phobia. That was a that was a, a step, but only a small step above the last one. Food binge, wander, days. Things are getting a little bleak. We don't have any booze, and I, I, when I, so I, I, t I said before I did a little test on this to make sure I had everything working okay. I didn't do a good enough job because <laughs> I didn't get any this. But if we get the research done, we can get going and get some cider. And I hope we can make cider. I don't know what we need for it. it doesn't say apple juice that's fermented for a few days to develop this alcohol content. But how do you get apple juice? You get unferm unfermented apple juice to come from. Just needs a brewer and a cooking table. I don't know. A presser for the apple juice? Oh, we need, so we're going to need more. We're going to need a, a presser also. Okay. Okay. Well, with multiple researches, we can hopefully get this thing done. Um, no one to trade with. Kind of hosed here. I, th I'm, I, I, I'm not a cheater. I'm tempted to step in and just throw in some booze just so we get, so so we can get something, just so we can keep playing, you know, without uh, losing. I looked at the time and I was like, man, is it? It's only that time, but uh, daylight savings is confusing. Uh, I would like you to go in and council removes a bad memory. Can you give? Can you do this for someone? Like, like, well, Burns has lost his mind. But anyone having like a bad, bad time? We oh, have you those. What we can do to make things a little nicer. We're cleaning it up, so the place is cleaner. Is it still a sad bunk? No, you're on the ground and you're in the heat. It's pretty hot. Hmm. Silver over there. We're so fast at mining, we can mine that thing in, in no time. Have we even made any simple meals? I haven't even been watching. We do those over here. Okay, cook his marmello. Sleeping. Uh, other one's back. You are researching. We need you. Those will be in seconds. Those will be a little while still. Low food, but if we had plant cutting on, we get these berries brought in. Maybe we should go ahead and do that a little higher. A visitor, explosives expert. 
Mash. If you came in and you had some beer in your pockets, well, then you'd be dead. You're welcome to visit all you want. Oh, MASH does have a gun. There are guns out there. Ancient's pattern blowback operated self-loading pistol. Chaos is on an insulting spree. All right. We're desperate for beer. We've got like, uh, our, our, our mouths are all chapped. Our beards have got like, we've got like dandruff all over our beards because we're our unhealthy um, alcohol. Does uh, <laughs> have a logging working sites nearby? What's the deal with this? There's two people here. There's some loot there. Well, we can go here. There's, there's there's wood there. I got it. Yep, we're all pale. Starvation? Oh, because Burns was... He's, uh... Having a bad time. Get Pablo back. <laughs> Thanks, bloody, for following. Oh, Burns is training up his melee. Chaos insulted him, and he did not like that. Visitors. They have a few items to trade. Okay, Wally. Please, Wally. Please, Wally. Please, Wally. I don't ask for much. But just a little... Just a little drink. Small flask would, would would do so much for us. Come on, Wally. Uh, who's this supposed to be trading? I don't know. Uh, Marmello is pretty good. They have some cool gear. Oh, poor health. You got weapons. I don't want your dang weapons. Oh, you don't want you. I can sell you weapons. You got my bow. You got that great. Well, we probably keep that. I don't want your weapons. All right. Um, Wally, do you have anything in your pockets? You got bread. What about your friend here? Bread. I got a bunch of bread. And he has a crossbow, which is cool. He's got it. Look at this. Check out this. His halberd. Neat. His, his heater shield. Cool looking stuff in this mod. Uh, Mad, Mad Dog. Thanks for following. All right, um, I'm gonna take a break real quick. Uh, go to the bathroom. Um, here's the question. Do we, do we throw down from the heavens, take on dev, no, dev mode, throw a couple pieces of, of, of beer, a couple cubes of beer uh, at the dwarves so we can continue on without everyone losing their minds? Or do we let it play out and just hope that we can get this stuff done in time before they all lose their minds? Burns at the moment, is uh where is it um he's got it's it's at 30 days how long has he been gone without it he's been 14 days so we got 16 days left until they drop into a coma so we gotta throw cubes of beer yeah <laughs> uh at them we gotta get beer done within 13 days we'll have this stuff grown in a few and we can get it in the barrels i don't know how long it takes for the barrels to work I mean, maybe we'll like cut it real close, or we can just cheat, throw some beer at him. There we go. We got a pull. Okay, I'll be right back. Give me just a minute. All right. Um. So um. I have decided. I haven't decided yet. What What do we do about about the uh about this? It's sixty three percent grown, so it's almost there. I think I like I I'm I like games like Door Fortress, so I like I like torturing myself. And um, I like the challenge of this, so I'm going to stick with it. We're, um, 
No, no, uh, no, there will be no, uh, Untinti presence, well, as, uh, right now, to give us more hops. We're just gonna have to, um, hope that we, it comes in fast enough. Now, it's gonna come in, in a minute, we can pull it up somewhat at a reasonable time to, uh, here, what am I trying to say? Here, we can get it pulled up pretty soon, and get it in the barrels, and hopefully get some beer made. Yeah, we got a lot of time. Untinti's with us, just having a nap in the corner right now. That's right. That's right. Um, we can get the stuff. We got the stuff pulled up. We got to get to the to the kitchen to to wart it up, and then we got to throw it in the barrels and let it do its thing. I don't know how long it takes. Does it tell me how long it takes? Uh, that doesn't tell me how long. Um, I don't know how long it takes, but. We'll find out. Plenty of time as long as anything as long as anything doesn't go wrong. Ah, funny. Very funny. <laughs> very, very, very funny. Okay, a little mal a little malnutrition. Everyone's hungry because they're not like uh eating. Do we even have any have any food now? No. Okay. Um Zon is awake. Oh no, he's not. Where is he? Going to bed. Okay, we'll let him go to bed. I don't think anyone's trying to talk trying to talk to Pablo. I think they're just locking him away. We'll keep him locked in there. Um, we'll get we we've got a cat we can eat, you know. Um, but we can go. We got. Oh, what did you give me? Beer. I don't want your dumb hat. Beer shirt. Uh, we've got some. We got plenty of of berries. We can pick for for some food. Quick food. Chaos is researching. Now, other question. Um, if we get the so we get say we get the cider done, and then we go back and get the presser done, which is even longer. It says apples. Brings out the juice or whey from curds. But does that mean, like, do berries count? There's no apple trees, are there? No apples in the game. Do we plant smart for cutting? I don't know what you mean. Oh, what was that? The manis. That was loud. Thank you very much for the rain. Appreciate that. Yeah, so we can we can harvest when we hit sixty five percent. That's when we can do an early harvest, and we'll probably do that. There's a chance of it of it giving you nothing, so we'll probably do that soon, as soon as we can, just to get something in there in in the the barrel. Everybody's starving at the moment. Uh, Mangus, go and start harvesting them them berries. And berries and dim berries and oh, hold, I held shift. Why didn't you listen? Go berry harvesting. We're just gonna keep on sowing. We'll have a nice constant supply there. We're gonna have a load of potatoes. Which actually we can pull these potatoes out right now. It'll be all right. Stage dives. Hi, uh, how you doing? Thanks for hopping in. Chaos, you're right there, buddy. Got a little beat up there. You got oh, he hit you. He hit you in the leg with his head. Okay. These are marked as harvest, not cut, right? Let me cancel some of that. I'm gonna cancel all these. I'll deal with this stuff on my own. We'll come in here. We need to, we need to drop some trees down. Um, we just get like this big guy here, like those. Okay, keep on harvesting. Bring those berries in, and as long as they're outside, people will get them. Um, you gonna go eat? Yep, yep. 
Burns. Uh, feed some berries to Pablo. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Armel's gonna go eat. Uh, you can eat when you're done harvesting. Then you can eat. Nice thing about the forest. The forest's got all kinds of food in here. And then we'll set... Um, I'm gonna go research. Here, let me go ahead and set you on... Let's do a little harvest. Like a row of these things. No, not you. Pablo's spirit is broken. As a result, he was forced to question everything. Certainly, uh, his certainty of belief is is uh, having troubles. He's, he's starting to give up on our, our religion here because he's locked in this little room. Um, being a jerk. Yeah, a berry wine. That's what I'm hoping that we can get out of it. But I don't know if it does works that way. I'm pretty sure I've played a mod before that had a berry mod in a uh, berry wine in it before. There may be a tree we can grow, like grow apple trees or something. It would be very good. You're right. Any animals out here? The same things. Are they very mean? How do you know how, um, how tough they are? We, I think I looked at it before, didn't I? Yeah, they're pretty tough. Ah, there we go. We can see where they're from. Like, if you were to come over here and, like, try to tame this fellow. It doesn't say there's a chance of him. 100% chance of... Okay. 100% chance of a base when they get harmed. I have a pelt in storage. Yeah, I do feel like we were missing, um, yeah, it's bees and mead stuff. I agree. We can all work together and try to hunt one of those things. Might be what we need to do. There's a squirrel or we can eat the squirrel. Burns, go kill that squirrel. <laughs> the cat's got it. Okay. Cargo pods full of beer. Rubies. What am I supposed to do with rubies? Marmel's going berserk again. Will you knock it off? Bring them rubies in here. So we've got a... Um, where's he at? He's going to go kill somebody again. He's gone berserk. Dinner, stay away. Gavin, watch out. Gavin, watch out! Smash up some furniture. Marmello's lost it. Oh, Gavin won. Okay, good job, buddy. Uh, what's what's now that uh, Burns go and rescue Marmelo. Gavin is uh, gonna go have a little nap there. Where is he at? Oh, you can break that if you want. He broke my door. Now what are you breaking? My other door. Stop it! Mangus is having a tan- <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, it's getting kind of hairy. Burns, you okay there, buddy? You're a little beat up. Wait, that squirrel. Okay, fix Marmello. Mangus is breaking my rocks. Hey, work frenzy, I'll take that. Mangus is just breaking things. It's fine. Marmelo, you alright there, buddy? Yeah, you got torn up by that. By, by uh, Gavin there. Burns is starving. He's gonna tend to himself, then he'll go, he'll go eat. 
my Jewish break. Stop it. Burns is now having a tantrum. Why doesn't everyone just have a tantrum while we're at it? Oh, they're going to tantrum together. They're, they're sharing their tantrum. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Pablo's escaping. Pablo, probably a good idea. Probably not the best place to be. Cider is done. Okay. Uh, we got to get the presser done, though. It's even longer. The classic dwarven tantrum spiral. Yep. Yep. Um, okay, so it's no longer Pablo's room. We'll make... Um, it's going to be Pablo's room. Man. Oops. Pablo. Get back in there. No, oh, he's mad now. Don't punch him. Can I tell you to do anything? Or can I tell him to do anything? Um, are you... Can you come and animal busy? Can you like go and punch him? It's too hard to see those squares. Okay, you got him knocked out. Good job. Good job. Um, Zon didn't even wake up. He's still sleeping. He's getting punched by Pablo, and he's like, ah. Here we go again. <laughs> this bed should belong to somebody. Here you go. Burns, knock it off. We need those barrels. Ale wart, or... Grape must. Can't do either of those. No items like that. Yeah. Okay. Burns. You please just calm just just calm down, please. Just just calm down. No food. Mangus, I'm gonna have you wake up, buddy. Cause we gotta go and start harvesting some what? Oh, Pablo died. Pablo. He had the most dwarven name of everyone. He's dead. Okay, get those get those potatoes hauled in. Burns you awake. Tend to yourself. Good idea. And you're going where? Where are you going now? So tend to yourself. Let's get Pablo out of here. The cat's fine. The cat's sleeping with the dead guy. Uh, come over here and... Harvest the area. Our doors are broken. There we go. Look at all these potatoes. Everyone's eating them raw. It's fine. It's fine. It's not, That'll help their mood. These are at 73, so they're almost there. Okay, Burns, I want you to go go and harvest this one. Please get some. What do we need for? I think we need like 10. How much do you need in here? I don't know. Who's, who's break risk? Marmelo is the worst. Okay. Burns is sleeping. I'm going to let him sleep. Marmelo's running wild. Um. Okay, buddy. Be free. B 
Be free, buddy. Marge, is that your bed? I'm gonna make sure Burns does the does does that. Where's he going with those berries? I was gonna eat the table there. Can you come and um see if you can, see if you can tame him? Those potatoes hauled in here. Got a mad turkey. That's fine. We'll love, we love to eat it. We need a lime. We got a limestone meteorite just hit us. Be better if it was a beer meteorite. Got him. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, haul that turkey. Our cats, we gotta eat some cats. I know it's terrible, but they're too, they're too small. We could eat, I guess when they get a little bigger, how long does it take them to get, they're four days old, we need bigger cats. When they get bigger, we'll, we'll cook the babies. <laughs> Just realize what I'm saying. And then, um, <laughs> yeah, you, you get the idea. Why is it always my cook that runs away? Mangus, uh, I'd rather you cook first and then construct seconds. Need 25 hops for that. Okay. More raw food. Okay, so let's go out here. Uh, Burns is awake. I want him to harvest that and then harvest the area. Uh, Marmello is uh, it's just sort of hanging out around here. As much as I want this research, yeah, I think we have to have it. We have to get that research. That gives us the ability to make... Apple juice. We can ferment apple juice now. We make we can make apple juice when we do it. We can ferment it. Uh, well, we can't make apple juice yet. Well, we when we can make it, we can we can ferment it. We don't know how to make it yet though. I'm sure, we didn't get anything new there. We need to get the presser. Once we get the presser, we'll have that. Build that. We've got five. We got five out of that. Oh boy. It's open like, I don't know, 50 or <laughs> something. So these rubies. Uh, one of the things we can make is the cleaning cleaning bench. And then we can like scrub those rubies. And uh, I don't know if rubies are one of the ones, but we can like, I don't know how it works. It's kind of weird. Um, I can't really make the beer yet. I was hoping, I'm hoping that the presser will allow me to use berries. I don't know if it does or not. I'm hoping it will. Okay, simple meals are getting made. It is a long task, and it might be better. Oh, the uh, Pablo got eaten. Might be, um, I'm not sure whether it's better to have him doing that or. Something more productive. He was taken. Okay, that's fine. Resting. Burns. What are you doing? Sleeping. Mangus is cooking. You are uh, on a. You are on a work thing. So I, I, I got him on research right now. I think we're going to change that because I think it'd be better just to have them out. Burns is a good a good grower. He's very good at it. Is there anything is there anything better that we could have them doing? 
things we can get made. We gotta get those torches replaced because it's dark in here. Zon's always in a daze, eating raw food. We need a priest, but I'm kind of afraid to do that because they're going to get mad because they don't have a cape. Just haul those potatoes. Okay, we got meals. We got meals. Unbelievable. I can't make... Oh, we got these food baskets, so we should throw things in the food baskets. Also, we got turkey there we can cook. Hey, before you... Oh, you're losing your mind. Ooh. Man. Randy Random losing, and losing his fun is rough stuff. Fully healed, but you're back. You're still losing your mind. Hermelo's eating my meals. Don't eat the potatoes. We got. Oh, we're out of meals. Why don't you butcher that? Oh, we broke our, uh, I didn't realize we broke our butcher thing. Build the butcher spot so we can get that turkey cook, cook, cooked up. When Burns wakes up, we'll get these, the rest of these potatoes done. Which actually might not be enough. I thought we had enough food there, but maybe not. Pablo's been eating my breakfast. Or for breakfast. One or the other. It's good. It fed the cats, I guess. <laughs> His whole body got eaten. What did he need to bury the guy? He all got eaten. Uh, Chaos, don't, don't worry about... Just haul them. Yeah, let's have a tantrum. Okay, there's, there's, there's a tree getting done. Okay. Man, it's rough. It's rough going in here. I didn't realize that was going to be the challenge today. But apparently it is. Mangus is having a meal. Cooking some meals. Mangus, relaxing. Good idea. No, I'm not going to touch that. Burns harvesting them potatoes. We got a bunch. Look at those potatoes there. Okay. Okay, tend to chaos. Does he need it? Yeah, he's a little bloody. Oh, he never got treated for that turkey bite. Okay, we'll tend to that. Mangus is going to cook more meals. That's good. Burns. Just go have a, go have an eat. Uh, go feed chaos. There you go. I guess what are you doing? Cooking. I don't know that I'm gonna make it. Those hops grow really slow. We got five hops so far. They grow really slow. Four more meals getting done. New quest available, the wanted prisoners. House Soren captured two prisoners from an enemy faction and they want a place to store them. Let me watch over them for a few days. If I do it, I get Lucero. I'd get Lucero, who's not a dwarf. We'd have one guy who could do a lot of jobs and wouldn't be alcohol dependent. So when everyone's all in comas, he could be out there doing the fields. I do it. I accept. Okay, uh, this is going to be prisoner room. Don't have a door. 
Actually, we don't have, we don't have any doors, do we? Okay, there's our prisoner room. Um, we need... There's the prisoners. Where's uh, where's what's his face? Oh, we don't get him until afterwards. Oh, all right, all right. No, I'm not gonna keep him a lot. How long do I have to keep him? You can go without eating for a while. Go ahead and strip these guys. See why they need their clothes. 15 days. Okay. Keep them alive for 15 days. We might all be dead in 15 days, but we'll do what we can. Uh, I need some more of this. Expand the zone a bit. Make sure we got plenty of hops. I'm going to go ahead and expand this zone as well. Like that. And I may actually do... Let's do another zone here of just like... Rice or something. Um... Nutrifungus, I think, has, Nutrifungus has to be in a, like, not bright place, I think. I don't remember. You're already having problems? Chaos is having a bad time. Chaos, what's the problem, buddy? Ooh. Man, if we could just get this stuff done. I don't know if it all would be well, but some would be well. Chaos. I know you're having a rough while you're resting. Bebe's vomiting all over the place. Turkey is not looking too good. Tame Marmello. Give him some potatoes. He loves potatoes. Ah, oh, we got Marmello back. Okay. Marmello. All oh, right. Something good happened. He's still very dependent uh, on, on alcohol, but he's one of us. Okay. Where are you going? You want to take, go in bed? I wish I could make some more of these beds. Chaos, I want you to go and can you build this? I'm going to go rest. I know you do, buddy. I know you do, but I need you to do a job real quick. I need you to build this butcher thing. Then I need you to butcher that turkey. Okay, now... Can I tell you to do that that way? Oh, I know way. Uh, butcher things forever. Now, butcher. Butcher focus has to be indoors. It has to be indoors or just... Can I just have it roofed? It has to be... I can't put it on like this floor though. It can't be on, on granite. It has to be on like the dirt floors, right? I can't just like throw it wherever. Zon's feeding some potatoes to people. Uh, why don't you just... Um, well, you don't haul. Mangus is cooking. Good. <clears throat> Get those brought in. Um, we keep these guys alive for 15 days. We can throw some potatoes at them. We can get some beer, and then we're going to be starving again because we won't have any food. But Burns is going to work on planting some things. Right, Burns? Clearing this stuff out. Stop! Please stop botching the harvest. Why is he botching every single harvest? Maximus is going going uh, berserk. Let me night out in the daytime. I gotta keep this guy alive. Can you um, capture that guy? Wait! Don't give him any of our meds. No, no meds. Just give him some band aids. Nice if you'd stop watching those harvests there, Burns. 
It is also pretty, pretty hot. Oh, my base is considered outdoors because we don't have any walls anymore. Any of these. <laughs> Food poisoning. Stop botching the construction! He's dark to grow, but dies in lights. Indoors are caves, okay. So we could, we could grow it like right here, couldn't we? We switch this out from storage over to a a grow zone. Not that we have any space for this stuff, but um, like that, because it's, it's all I, I got a roof over that, and we make that nutrifungus. I'm gonna expose to light. I knew that, um, but there's a oh, there's not a roof there. Roof that area. Just a bunny, buddy. Okay. Go get patched up. Tended to quest available paid heat wave. Machine persona is orbiting ship, performs some planetary experiments. Uh, she wants to do a heat wave. That would be real bad. No thanks. No thanks. I'm going to get a heat wave anyway, so. Almost there. Burns is tending. Burns, um, I really should wait, but I really need to get stuff out of the ground. Let's go get a couple of these pulled out. The 87s can go. The 88. And the 86. I gotta get something in there. Is it always five? Need one more. Prisoners are losing their minds. Okay, there we go. Now, haul that stuff. He's punching our guy again. I broke my door again. Okay, now go and... You're not much of a cook. You're not a bad... You're not a bad cook, though. So go and brew. Okay, and then... um. I'll wake, I'll wake Mangus up. Build that door. Okay, we got some wart getting made. We gotta rescue these guys too. Um, tend to him. Marmello! Capture these folks. Oh yeah. Our first, our first beers are getting made. You know, the game's actually been, I don't want to jinx anything. The game's been pretty peaceful. <laughs> Other than the lack of alcohol, it's been pretty calm. Got some wild animals and all that, but other than that, hasn't been too bad. That guy's escaping. Hey, Alice, can you go capture this guy, please? There's no place to put him. We has a door. We'll capture him in a second. Yeah, we don't have to call any wealth. I'm sure that's what is uh, keeping things uh, keeping things down. Why is there only five? If you tell me that only that 25 of these things makes five, I'm gonna be upset. Um, we need to 
get this thing in there. I don't think I I hope not. Otherwise we need a lot of farming. Um Make that quick. Where are you going? Build that door. Quickly. Guys, do you have, you have a weapon? I'll let you go. Burns can handle this guy. Okay. Go arrest that guy. Capture that guy. Who's the medical emergency? Is he me? Who's barfing there? Is my cat barfing? Okay, Burns is done. Uh, yeah, you can tend to the guy. Let's get Mangus. I need you in here getting this thing filled. Where do I see Colony Wealth? That's in... Here? Wealth. It's only gone... It's only gone down. <laughs> it's gone down. That's about right. Everything's just gotten worse since we got here. But when we get that... When we get the beer going... Just you wait. Man, it's gonna be... Uh, it's gonna be a whole new day. Everything's gonna be... Everyone's gonna be happy... And, um, there would just be no sadness anymore. 25 hops. Mangus, what are you doing? You're going to go eat some berries. Uh, why don't you just haul these things in? We'll get a cook going. Getting that going. Um. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. More berry eating going on there. We can get those potatoes hauled in there and get them cooked. Burns, what you doing? Consume some berries. Um, sure, sure. 99%. Almost there. These are at what? 81. These are in the 80s now. Okay. 91 over there. Alright. How long does it take? Hmm... It can hold 25. It's only holding 5 right now. It is kind of slow. Okay, two of them, been, two of them been, have been plucked. Oh, it did actually give us more than than 5. Good. Okay, so when these are ready at 99 or 100%, then we're going to be good to go. More like false hope, Randy. <laughs> yeah. I ran out of wood because I built all these floors. Place is trash now. I did try to make things look a little nicer, but uh, it didn't really work that way. We'll get there eventually. For now, we'll, we'll let it be. Uh, I need this done. No failing at this time. What's he running away for? Why did he? I never. He stopped like halfway through the construction. Why are they fixing it? Finish the door. What about that one? There we go. Seems about no one longer assigned. Why? Oh, because all the stuff just, uh, because of the... Why? Why is it all for prisoners? Colonists. Marmello went berserk. Uh, dinner's been beaten to death. Uh, can we get everyone here to take care of Marmello, please? A dad joke. Um, all right. So th this year for um, for Halloween, I decided to be a, uh, a congressional 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 bill for Halloween. That was my, my Halloween costume. I stayed in the house and I didn't accomplish anything. <laughs> Politics. Politics jokes. <laughs> Do 
He also kind of getting a little bit whooped there. Just a little bruising, though. Okay, got him taken care of. Go get him fixed. Uh, this should be owned by somebody. Uh, we'll give it to Burns. Okay. Go, go uh, rescue Marmello. Travelers are coming by. Travelers, do you have anything to sell? If they pick my plants, I'm going to be a real man. Any more hundreds? Any close to a hundred? I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till they get to a hundred. I, th well, I don't know. No, maybe not. Let's get a few more in there. Get a few more started in there. If we just get like one drink, and they're pretty well set, we don't have to have a whole bunch. He's botching so many of them. Still, that's fine. That's enough. Um. Get him hauled. And then, who is our cook? Mangus. What are you doing, Mangus? Sleeping. Outrageous. Marmillo, are you, are you healed? Okay. Oh. Oh, the ward was chewing on you. That's right. Mangus Jailbreaker. What does that mean? Mental break is uh, going to induce prisoners to escape. Mangus, I need you cooking. Prison break. They're going to try to hit you now? Where do you go, Mangus? I'm going to fail my quest here. Um, you have to attack him? Okay. One down. Two down. Get him in there. Uh, Zahn's awake. I want you. I know you want some berries, but I want you to go and cook. The beer is nowhere near done. It's at the ideal temperature, but it's nowhere near done. Hey, you ate the squirrel off of the meat hook. 15% complete. This thing's never going to be done. I don't know about this beer thing. Fix Marmello up. Can you please stop breaking all the doors? Burns, uh, come over here and get some brewery done. Fortnite ads. Oh, man. Everything's breaking. They're bra <laughs> breaking everything. Oh, they broke the door again. You broke my bed. Oh, man, I need that bed. Burns is in a mur murderous rage. He's decided to kill Ulleran. Okay. Please put Burns down. Okay, done. Go rescue Burns. Um, he 
get a bed spot here. I keep switching over. Oh, because of that. Why does it keep switching like that? Rescue burns. Build a door. You guys are going to be so happy when that beer gets done. Missing hops. Oh, there it is right there. It's just sitting by the thing waiting to go in. Infection. Zeebie's got an infection. Zeebie, you just got to live a few more days. I don't care about how you... How, anything else. Marmello, build a door. Who else we got? Zon, where you at? Cooking. Good. Yeah, but it, it does, it's weird that it, it, I know I can't make a prison, but it, it automatically switches everything to a prison rather than the other way around, which is kind of weird. Get some starving going on. He's going to whip up four meals there. Table broke. They're going to eat without a table, and they're going to lose their mind. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The thing is, they only really need, like, one beer a week, basically. And they're fat, and they're fine. It's, I think it's after like f five or six days. If they go five or six days without a beer, then they start getting then they start getting the negatives. As long as they have it, though, they're fine. So we don't have to have a lot, just enough to keep them sane. Oh, we got a self-tamed rocks. Oh yeah, all right. I'll happily eat that guy. If I say butcher, um, where is he? That's right, he can be tamed to everything. We can like, tame him to haul and all that. It's a really good animal. I'd love to have it. But it'd be a lot of meat. I'd love to have it. But I'm just so hungry. <laughs> so we're going to slaughter that guy. Sorry, buddy. A lot of patching up to go uh, go on burns there. A lot of bruises. A lot of band-aids. You yelling at us? Yeah. Oh, am I missing it? No, there's a bed. He's just not in there. Have a meal. Okay. Um, see, look, it's going. It's at, why is it ruined? Oh, I have to keep it at a temperature of seven to the thirty-two. Well, this is going to be impossible. There's no way. I have no. How do I do that? I don't have uh, a cooler. How am I supposed to do that with, with these dwarves? Okay. I want to keep playing. I'm, I'm making the executive decision. Um, if I can remember how to do it. Because it has changed, apparently. Um, <laughs> I don't know how to do dev mode anymore. Um, maybe I won't do dev mode because I don't remember how to... How to <laughs> it's changed. There it is. Okay. I know... I know. I'm, I'm ashamed as well. But, um, if I can't make the booze, well, then we got a problem. Um, Praise on Tinty. I'm going to spawn a thing. Okay. 
dev mode off. Okay, Marmelo. Why don't you go drink yourself a beer? Chaos. Wake up. Burns. You know we know what this what this coalition is gonna be selling us. You know they're gonna have a whole bunch. <laughs> Ship to the stars. Okay, beer for Mangus. Mangus, let's see how your mood has changed. Uh, it's still pretty bad, but uh, you got alcohol warmth. Okay, they're all here. Uh, let's have a chat with them. You have, um, no, you don't have beer. Okay. Well, I will sell you the shirt and the, the wrap and the veil and the toque. I can do something with those rubies. I'm not going to mess with that. Um, I do kind of want some cloth. I can buy a donkey from you, huh? Well, if I buy if I buy cloth, I can get like a soft chair, which would be a big mood boost. I don't remember how much how much it uh, how much those um I don't know how many how many those are. Let's just get to where we've got like I think they're like seventy five or something. So let's just get two hundred cloth. Most of my, most of my money is gonna go into this. Um. We got potatoes now, so food is is set for a bit, for a little bit. Uh, we got to ready to eat our our animal as well. Uh, we've got we have beer now. I think it's better to sell the rocks and buy the meat, or just cook the rocks, because then I get the meat, and I'm sure I get more meat out of the rocks. Do you think it'd be better? Sell this guy and then buy a bunch of just like horse meat or insect meat. Maybe that might be a bad idea. Do I buy the meat or do I buy the insect meat? People, insect meat is no good. I buy two hundred snake meat. That'll get us for a while. Oh, actually, I can't buy that much. I'll buy a hundred snake meat. Think he's worth a hundred meat? How do we know how much he gives us? Meat amount. 448. Okay, yeah, we're not doing that. Okay. You guys aren't taking my beer, are you? Very important to me. There he is. Nice and slaughtered. Don't eat him. Gavin, stop it. I need missing a corpse. A corpse right there. Get, get Gavin out of there. How do I move the, move the rocks? How do I move it? There it goes. Not working. Okay. A little less meat now. Ooh, we, we got a horn out of him too? Oh, all kinds of good stuff. We got a, a huge rocks pelt. What do I do with that? I need 40 cloth for this bedroll, which I just bought. Did I buy, um... Did I buy... I bought a, the cloth, right? I don't remember what I bought. I I don't remember what I, I yeah I got there's cloth right there so let's get that's probably the more important thing than than what, what I was talking about before let's get some, some cloth that's more important than the um uh, ooh na chaos nasty more important than the chair we get the cloth beds 
You right there, Burns? Extreme pain. And you're starving. Can you, can you go feed him? Burns, can you get up? Go feed him. Zon's in a rage. He's gonna attack these guys, isn't he? <laughs> Who's he going for? My brother Pop. Oh, Pablo was your brother? Who's he going? <laughs> Who's he going for? <laughs> he's just standing there. Oh, sadistic, not murderous. Okay, he's gonna go yell at everyone. All right. Come with me. Okay, cook up that meat. Good. Get some meals in this place. Chaos, I need you to... I need a door. I'll let you rest for a bit. Everyone should have... Eat without a table. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Marmelo's having a little bit of a crisis. This place is a dump. But it's a dump that has alcohol now, thanks to um, um, the uh, the Rimworld gods. Our hops are ready to harvest. When Burns wakes up, he has a job to do. He's in mind-shattering pain. <laughs> He's been patched, though. Finally. Oh, my guest died. Um, failed the quest. I don't get that guy now. Well, fine, fine. A gift, what'd you give me? Ooh, a knife? Oh, you're too kind. Yeah, this is never going to... It's never going to work. I have no way of, of keeping my temperature. How is that supposed to work on... That's strange. Something's missing. Does this one have the same thing where it has a... Yeah. It needs a temperature between 13 and 45 degrees Celsius. Actually, that's a little better. But it's not the same kind. We can't do the um, beer in there. But what are the chances? Those are That's ruined... That one's not ruined. Like, that's a strange um, thing for, um, I, I think it's just, it's, obviously it's mod stuff, so it's a little weird. But we're like dependent on, we're tribal, dependent on, on, uh, what? Chaos of the Mental Breakdown is going to venture anger on animals. You have slaughtered Gnome Nip. Well, looks like we're eating Gnome Nip. This place is... Look at this place. There's vomit all over the place. There's blood everywhere. <laughs> oh, you're still killing people? You killed breakfast now. Stop killing all my cats. Please? Two less mouths to, see, to feed now. Oh, you just killed Gavin! Maximus has given up on this community. Decided to leave. Pursue a better life. Who? Who? The prisoner? Okay. Have, <laughs> okay. It's too bad the prisoner's not happy. Look, I don't need you harvesting that. I need you harvesting this. Actually, I don't need this as much. This isn't as important anymore. I'm going to switch this stuff over to... Uh, what's something that makes us happy? Uh, cotton would be nice. I think we're going to grow... I think maybe just turn it over to potatoes. Just lots of potatoes. Everyone loves potatoes. I'm not going to do as many hops because we can't keep them. Until we learn how to keep them the temperature the same. Not much we can do about it. 
there's no passive coolers in this. In um, typically in in tribal tech there is, but there isn't in this one. I don't get them. I don't know where they come in. Oh, there it is, right there, a passive cooler. It's weird that it's such a difficult thing to make in this game because beer is such a such a integral part of civiliza civilization. Mickey Mouse rubies. Extract tree. Hmm. Burns is wandering around. He's kind of sad. Burns, you got your beer. Prisoners died. Warg died. No priest. Uh, you haven't had any beer yet? Burns, get some beer. Alcohol warmth. Make sure everyone's got it. Marmello is... I think Marmello is good. Good enough. Hmm, I got nine meals. Meals. A whole bunch of meat here. I should make this... I should make this more, more meals. Like 20 meals. They're going to last longer than the meat will. I'm not really doing the research anymore, which we're getting the presser, which I guess isn't as important. I guess maybe a passive cooler is the important one. I keep changing this. Uh, we start with the agriculture, like lentils and things. Let's go ahead and get this one done, because it's a pretty quick one. We should have it pretty quickly. Sane, thanks for following. It is late, uh, even though the time doesn't say it is late, so we should wrap this up eventually. Mello, what can I do to make you happier? Well, a lot of things. You're not sleeping on the ground. You're sleeping there. My friend Pablo died. Pain, insulted, hideous environment. These are all things we could probably take care of. I need to get this. I need to get this. This is all outdoors right now. That needs taken care of. That's weird that doesn't have a Z next to his name. Everyone else is sleeping. He's just resting. Go to that door. Okay, we're indoors again. Go to that door. Um... Gonna cheat my way through the beer. That's probably a good idea. Let's let's forbid it. We need to get someone to do this role. Uh, do we give it back to Marmelo? I don't think so. I think we're gonna give it to Zahn. He seems like he's been the the sturdiest of us, so he can be. What was that neat? A catharsis is big time. He can be our new priest. My fortress is hideous. <laughs> we need someone to come in here and just clean everything. <laughs> I've never seen such a terrible, that's a horrible looking fortress. It's so bad. I need someone. Okay. What's, man, I don't know what the priorities are. Everything's a priority. Uh, other things to get also we're getting agriculture, but the other thing would be get is like that rustic furniture to give us beds. Uh, beds would be nice, bookshelves, um, fur beds and end tables. We don't need a lot of we got a lot of that stuff. So chaos is fully healed. Cut some trees down. Thanks, Burns. Get some potatoes uh, hauled in here before they rot. There's a little bit of cleaning, like, in the food area is a little bit cleaner than it was. Probably wouldn't hurt to have alcohol binge, but it's forbidden. 
Wouldn't be hard to have this place a little cleaner. I just said you were the one who's like stable. Bunch of bones in here. I wish I knew what to do with that pelt. We had a large timber wolf pelt and we had the other the other one. Hey, this is actually moving along. I don't know what to do with the pelts. I'm sure there's a, there's something we can make later on. Making that just out of cloth there. Maybe something in the rustic furniture we can make a bit. Uh, when we're with door and dig it to overhead mountain uh, above. Oh, the problem is it's it's warmer outside than it is. Well, not anymore. Actually, let me remove that. That is putting out a lot too much heat. I'm gonna reinstall this thing outside. It is warm out there inside here. These torches might be adding up, I guess. <clears throat> One of these days, I've been talking about it forever. I'm gonna do just like a like a nice peaceful Rimworld day. I thought about doing it this time, but of course that didn't happen. Of just going in and and that's one of the things, that's one of the things I've seen with of complaints with Rimworld about how it, it ends up being kind of like a tower defense thing after a while because you just get endless rage, you know, and all that. Um, and I thought about doing just sort of like peaceful time, you know, we'll build, we'll have kids and see where we can just build this fortress and see what we can get to. But then I saw it was called, uh, you know, losing is fun. And that's, well, I couldn't resist. Okay, Burns has a nice bed now. Nice bed there for, we'll give that to Chaos. Me more cloth. We got a bit more cloth. We need one in. We need one over here. And uh, sure, there. Make the bed. Burns. Uh, get that stuff. Yeah. Good. Man, he drank a ton of that. He drank a ton. He drank like twenty bottles. You're gonna make me cheat more. Not change anything. Oh, it's yeah, it's 28 outside, 23 inside. So that did make a big difference. Oh man, this third time this has happened now. People run run wild. I don't like that one. Thanks for hanging out, Dan. That's true. Also, as a dwarf fortress runs, so we couldn't do anything too peaceful. That just wouldn't make any sense. Why is Burns going in there? Are you are you hurt? Oh, food poisoning. Alcohol binge again. This cleaning bench, we can go in there and we can like clean Ruby's skull. I don't know what that means. I don't know what any of these things mean. We have rubies. I guess we can make ruby skulls out of them. I'd love to make some of that. I don't know how to do it, but I would, that sounds like what I want to make. Stone cutting bench is broken. We have a whole bunch of... How many do we have here? 70 granite, granite bricks. Not a whole bunch. Did he just, like, poop? Now he's vomiting. Elf biters. Uh, does have has built up an alcohol tolerance. <laughs> and you're pregnant. Oh, nice. Oh, and you gave birth. You're not pregnant anymore. We got oh, we got two more kitties. Good. We because we just lost a bunch. We got two boy kitties now. Hmm. 
What is that? Someone lost, lost their boots. Okay, meals being consumed. Chaos, come chat with... Um... Oh, he's sleeping. Oh, it is too bright. There. Even with the roof there? Oh, because is it because of that? I just want to look at grow. I just want to try this out. You can sew over there, but not over here because of this now. Because of that. What am I supposed to do with this? It's too hot inside here. Oh, there, I guess. Another alcohol binge. All our alcohol is going to be gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think it's Mangus who took, his all, took all his clothes off. Doors are finally done. Beds are getting main. Get rid of that. This will be a, um, I'll just, yeah, just whoever wants it. Subject toxin drop. Um, house and em bois. Special request someone has dumped an abundance of toxic waste past near one of the settlements and he is unable to safely move, store them. If I accept, uh, they will deliver 90 waste packs by transport pod. Not kept frozen, they will dissolve over time, polluting nearby terrain. If I do it, tiny scale hide. I get some good medicine for doing it. Okay, we're throwing out the other side of the of the world. Who cares? Yeah. Where are they at? There they are. Okay, so we'll take that. Marmel is having a tantrum. These packs, where are they? Oh, they're over there. It's not too. It's a, it is a lot of them, isn't it? Just gotta throw them like up here somewhere. <laughs> Marmelo, I built just built that door. What do you break over here? I missed it. One of my one of my boxes or something. We got a raid. The Anderthals are raiding us. Okay, I hit the wrong button. Just one one guy. He's not coming. He's not coming here yet. Sneak. Low food. How can we? How can we eat low food? We, we ate all that already. Tons of food. We just not cooked. Oh, look at all the hops we've got in here now. Okay. Well, when they come, we'll be ready for them. Well, three of us will. Where's the other weapons at? I don't want a bow. Where's all my stuff at? There it is. Morning Star. Thrombos. Okay, here he comes. Legua. With a little knife.
What if we can attack him across this with the big pole arm? Uh, do we want to uh, imprison her? Yeah. Treehouse builder? You're not an elf, are you? What are you? You're a Neanderthal. Right. And our whole quest was to go get those elves down south. We're still going to do it. Still going to do it. This is just for selling. 100 bucks. Toss you in there. Don't mind the uh, the mess. He's still taming. Oh, look, it was, look, it was dead already. Well, the cats are like that. I get this. Gotta get this planted. To refuel that. I don't care about that being refueled though. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna uninstall it. If we won't get rid of it, we'll just uninstall it. Yeah, the war will eat her. Wish I knew what to do with those pelts. It may just be something to sell. Oh, he's all sticking up the place over here. Okay, we're out of alcohol again. We actually may get some in here. 73% complete. There's 10 of them in there. Burns is mad. He needs some he needs some alcohol. I guess he never he probably never got some before. It's all been drank. 74% complete. We may get there. It's 23 degrees inside. It's right on the edge of where it it's actually ideal. It's right where it's supposed to be. I'd rather you have you sew stuff. No, sew first. Shouldn't you sew first? Whatever. Yeah, it has been it has been Six meals just sprouted away in storage. <clears throat> That's a problem. Should put some doors like here as well. So then if that breaks open, we'll we'll have more. It'll still be indoors. Chaos is there. Where are you at? Researching. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. And the agriculture done, which will give us some plants. They may grow a little faster. We can also get a gardening box and put it inside. I'm curious how the millstone is going to work. Yeah, I'm curious about that. What if we do pack that stuff up? I keep finding clothes. If we pack this stuff up, wherever it went. Where is it? Over here. If we pack this stuff up on, on a um, a journey and just like drop it off somewhere, I'm up for that. All we have down here is elves and orcs to our, to up this way. So let's go like we're not really near a road. Let's just go here. Maybe we go a little further. Let's go there. Um, we'll let we'll let um you two do it. Bring the cat with you. And I want you to bring all of this stuff. Can you carry all of it? Oh, it's it's heavy. It's real heavy. We'd all have to go. That won't happen. If 
I had, you know, if I had that rock, I could have carried it. Or whatever it was called. Chaos needs some booze. Chaos is in a daze. I need to get this this going. Um, you come here and brew. I think we're actually we may have it now. Maybe that 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 heater was was killing us. The hearth. Okay, you now get it. Okay, got that. Yeah, make make twenty five of these things and then throw them in there and get a big big bucket. Burns, uh, you're out here messing with this stuff? Yep, chopping trees and all that, it's fine. Okay, everyone should have a bed now. Yeah, everyone's got a nice bed, good. Uh, we still have some cloth laying around, I think. Uh, may have used it all. Yeah, we used it all of it. Mangus is still out there. I'd like to get I'd like to get Mangus if we could. Chaos is our is our talker, so we'll let him do it. Um I turned uh actually I I didn't turn anything off. I, the mod might turn off the insect infestations, but I don't know. I actually didn't look. Um I do have on Um, the, the, there's like bugs and snakes or something. I'm kind of surprised they haven't hit us. But there is, there is other things out there that may get us. Careful from how Soren is approaching us. They are a ruins explorer. They will hang around a colony for some time before leaving. You can attack them, but they'll anger their faction. A ruins explorer. That's cool. Let's go, let's go chat. What's this stuff doing? Oh, they're grabbing it and putting it over here. Don't do that. A ring necklace. Gold ring embedded with pristine emerald offers a significant increase of wealth to its wearer, often seen to nobles and merchants. Neat. In books? Chanted tome made back in the golden age. Each page seems to be immeasurably steeped in ambiguity, imbued with signs of magic. Rendering the book unuseless. Rations. Mackey. Hearty, nutritious packaged bread. Prepared by wood rangers. Takes a long time to rot. Can still deteriorate. Lift left outside. Oh. Lemus. Codex does what? This doesn't say what it does. No description. It's just an ancient codex. Just a big old book. Hmm. All right. I don't want... Um, where are they? How do, where, where do I turn off the ra this stuff? They're bringing it over here. I don't know where it is, but I don't want it here. Obviously, <laughs> how do I get rid of this? It's gonna mess. It's gonna mess up my farmland. <laughs> how do I get that out of here? Uh, <laughs> it's critical that what what do they call it? Waste packs. Waste packs go there. Off of there. Oh, they even have banners. Look at them. Cool. I wish I could be cool like that. 
with banners and shields and and blue beards. But no, my place is a dump. At least we got beds now. Let's go fix that real quick. We do have 25 of this ready to go, so let's go ahead and... Marmelo, I know you're fixing that up, but come and fill that thing. Okay. Oh, this is finished. Agriculture is done, okay. Uh, Marmelo, go and take that out of there. Is it just beer? Does it come out in bottles? It does. We got ten. Oh, so f was there ten in there? Or was there five in there? I think maybe it was ten. Okay. Cool. Uh, go and fill this one too. Now, we've got agriculture. Let's go ahead and get furniture. So we can make... Well, we got beds now. Um, candles filled with tallow. Uh, do we want to get the presser now? The cat's drinking the beer. <laughs> Is it? Maybe we get basic, basic cooking. Let's get that one. We we'll figure something else out. The cat's drunk. Blackout drunk. <laughs> Marmel is carrying it away. <laughs> Okay. Well, there we go. Um, never does cleaning. Okay. Never set my Marlo, Marmelo up with any jobs. Um, he is... He's a good talker. Not as good as, as Zahn, though. Let's... Mm, I think he's going to cook. Nobody ever cooks, so Marmelo, you're cooking. Whatever happened to... Oh, yeah, my... he's out here. Somewhere. Mangus. Speaking of 4.30 in the morning. I need to go to bed. I'm going to have to come back to this. I'm, I'm enjoying this too much. Um, we've, we've, we've figured out beer production. The cat's drinking it all. Cats keep drinking my beer. That's a little bit of a problem. But, hops, hops, hops. Um, uh, we've got a bunch of hops now. We've got three beer. Um, they're not anywhere near complete, but we've got, that's 50, 45 beer in, in these barrels right now. So we're getting there. We can always, of course, load them up with some more and have a whole bunch of them. Where are you going with those? Oh, make some more. Excellent. Yeah, Mangus turned wild. Everyone turned wild in this. He's sleeping. How Soren is leaving. I would love to, to... You guys, you look... You're an inspiration. Just to look at you. I like it. I wish I could be like you. So I decided, uh, um, decided that uh, when I die, let's end on a high note here. Decided that when I die, I want a glass coffin. That actually happens, remains to be seen. That is going to be our high note to end this episode. Let's call it a day. Ancient mech. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> there they go. Farewell. I'll come back. I'll be back tomorrow night. And um, we may play some more of this. Um, we'll probably play some more of this. No promises, but probably more of this. And uh, we'll see if we can get... We'll see if we can get Mangus back. Mangus. We have beer, Mangus.
We have beer again. Don't arrest him. Hang on. No, we mean no food. We don't need food. Where'd all my potatoes go? Cats eating. What do you eat? You're eating the hops? No, you're drinking more beer, aren't you? The cats just can't get them out of the beer. Uh, let's sow some things. We got a little bit of a food problem. But we can hunt. Anyway. Let's call it a day. Where's he getting that amber from? Oh well. So, uh, Rimworld Dwarf Fortress style. Um, I will, uh, I'll get the, what's he carrying? He's eating a raw turkey. Okay, okay. Um, I'll, I'll, when I get this up, moving over to YouTube, I'll make sure I get the collection and the mods, uh, the mod collection done. For those of you that have shown up later, um, there's all my mods. Um, Medieval Overhaul is is the big one. And then in addition to that, I have one called... Oh, I don't know what it's called. Let me look. Uh, which which gives us things like um, uh, uh, the dwarves and the elves and, and orcs. <clears throat> Anonymous. Thank you for the gift sub. Thank you very much. Uh, it is um, Fantasy of the Rim. That's the one I added in. Elves, dwarves, and orcs. The medieval Overhaul is the one that is most me medieval stuff, and with it it needed the deep storage, oversized, weapon, oversized weapons, the processor framework, and that's it, I think. And hugs. Um, and Harmony, of course. So, there's all of them. I'll get these into a collection when I can figure out, when I can remember how to make collections. I, every time I go to make a collection on Steam, I always forget how to do it. So I have to go in, remember how to do it, make a collection, and I'll get them posted up there. I do have the start done, the, uh, the RimWorld Fortress. I have that one up there. But, anyway, thanks for hanging out for a daylight saving live stream. Oh, I forgot. I had a, I had a dad joke specifically for today. Daylight savings time. Did you know that Sean Connery would only trim his beard at certain times during the year? Daylight saving time.